And we are live. What's up everyone? Cadigan619 here and welcome back once again to the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke as we're picking things up where we left off. And folks, we are only one badge away from uh, getting to the Pokemon League. So maybe in this stream we could um, we could actually make it to the Pokemon League. Uh, maybe not if um, all doesn't go well that is anyway. So fingers crossed we will um, get through this. We've only one more badge, but there's some things I want to do uh, before we get to the Pokemon League, of course. And obviously uh, before the, uh, the gym badge. And hope everyone's doing good today. Hope you're having a good day. And uh, before we start things off, let's uh, go over the team once again. So I did big grinding and I got everyone to level 52. I think that is a good enough level, uh, like before the, the next gym leader. And going on to the Pokemon League as well. I mean, there's victory roll as well. So like I say we'll have the team fairly up to uh, a good level once we get there anyway. So first up, it is Poseidon or Swampert on the Earth Plate. And he's got Calm Nature. Uh, tinted Lens, power up, uh, not very effective moves. And he's got Surf, Earthquake. Yeah, when I was grinding him, we actually learned Earthquake, which, you know, I got rid of Mudshot because that was the weakest of the bunch. So we got Earthquake with uh, Swampert here. Crab Hammer and Mud Bomb. Next up, we have uh, Smokey the Ursa Ring. Calm Nature once again. It's got Sandstream. The Pokemon summons the Sandstorm in battle, which did help us when um, we went through Rayquaza back in the 6th gym. That did actually save us. Along with a Swampert, of course. So they're like the two survivors of that whole debacle. So he's got Rock Climb, Fly, Strength, and Defog. And he's pretty much our HM slave here. We haven't really used him that much. But yeah, that's what he really is. He's uh, our HM slave. And he did evolve from a Wingle, hence why he can fly. He's our flying bear. Next up is Dragon Zord or Palkia, home the Lustrous Orb to power up the Water and Dragon type moves, even though he's mainly got uh, Dragon type moves on him. Cotton Celestic Town. That was uh, probably the best encounter we have got so far in this uh, Nuzlocke. Unaware ignores any change in ability by the foe. And he's got Dragon Breath, Meteor Mash, Dragon Claw, and Spatial Rend. And yeah, he is uh, going to be a powerhouse uh, once we get to the Pokemon League, I think. Next up we have... Right. Yeah, I'll just let the soundboard say it there. <laughs> the uh, Raichu, Hunt the Light Ball. I think that does work with a Raichu. It is a Pikachu held item, but I think it works with Raichu as well. Maybe someone can uh, you know, tell me that as well. It's got Flame Body. Contact with the Pokemon may burn the foe, which could come in handy in all fairness now. Uh, oops. It's got Thunder Shock, Single Beam, Rock Smash, and Thunderball. Still yet to learn Thunder. I say we'll probably get rid of Thunder Shock uh, once we try to learn that. Next up, we have the T-1000, our Gallade, home the Razor Claw to get them critical hits. Gentle Nature. Simple, the Pokemon is prone to wild stat changes. It's got Psycho Cut, Cut, False Swipe, and Shadow Punch. Uh, decent enough moveset. We'll see if we can um, build up off it if we levels up a bit more. Next up, we have Jaden the Blaziken, home the Fist Plate to power up the fighting type moves. Modest Nature, likes dry food. And he's got Sticky Hole, protects the Pokemon from item theft. And he's got Blaze Kick, Double Kick, Slash, and Aura Sphere. And he was going to learn Flame, uh, was it Flame Blitz uh, as we were grinding them. But I kind of didn't want to go with that move because that does take a lot of health off you. So I decided against it. And that is it for the team, folks. And uh, yeah, let's uh, be on our way now. And one thing I will show you as well before we actually head off. And you will have seen it in the community tab and in my social medias and that. I decided on the Friday to check out what is the uh, the randomized Drifloon encounter, the uh, the Drifloon that uh, only comes up on Fridays. Lo and behold, Mewtwo. Yes, it was a Mewtwo, level 15. And yeah, call him Frieza, just like I did in the Fire Red Nuzlocke. We're not going to use him because we are pretty far into the Nuzlocke so far. And the other downside with this Mewtwo as well, we've seen it with the, you know, the encounters we have with him against, you know, trainers and that. He doesn't have the best ability. The Pokemon can't attack on consecutive turns. That is uh, going from uh, Slacking's uh, ability there. Bit shit, in, in all fairness now, but yeah. I, I decided I wanted to catch it because, yo, for Bragging Rice, of course. You see there, we got Giratina in the last stream, who was actually not randomized. Uh, yeah, Giratina was not randomized in the Distortion World, and I did catch him in the Master Ball. But yeah, I decided I wanted to show you that ju just for shits and giggles. Anyway, let's get right to it. And one thing that we're going to check out, if you've uh, seen the last stream, Professor Rowan has told us that the, uh, the Lake Trio have returned to their caves. And you know what, we're going to go out and uh, check what they're going to be randomized to. 
We will uh, do that. So I'm not sure with this stream, folks, are we actually going to finish off the Nuzlocke? Uh, we may or may not. All depends on uh, what happens, of course. Right, Verity Lake front. So we'll be going to uh, Lake Verity first. We'll be checking out the three lakes. And there's another spot that I want to check out that I found on the map while I was uh, grinding. Right, Swampert, let's go. Anyway, let me know how the game audio is as well. It should be okay. Right, Verity Cavern. Oh, so this is the roaming one. I don't think he uh, he gets randomized. Because I remember when I was in uh, playing the Soul Silver randomizer, when I was grinding for a bit in that, I decided I want to try and see what is uh, Raikou and Entei's randomized uh, Pokemon when they are uh, roaming around. Uh, they weren't randomized. I remember I encountered them level 40, the music was playing, and yeah, it was uh, legit them. So let's see if this is randomized, just like from um, you know, the previous game. Is it randomized or not? Uh, that definitely looks like it's not randomized. Yeah, it's going to go off. Uh, me Spirit uh, flew off somewhere. So, yeah, so it looks like... Oh, Rowan. Dot, dot, dot. That was Me Spirit, wasn't it? You've accomplished what I'd asked you to do at the Canalave Library. I asked you to get data on the Pokemon of the lake, and you did. But I didn't provide any answers about the mysteries of evolution. I still don't know why some Pokemon evolve and others don't. They just do. That, that's my theory. <laughs> Ultimately, it only to deepen the mystery. But having mysteries to solve, that adds to my enjoyment. Cat, why don't you chase after me, Spirit? Oh, what am I? Fuck. To me, it seemed as if I wanted to play with you. If you were to use the po uh, Poketch app marking map, you'd be able to track the movements of Pokemon. What? You don't have the marking map? You should occasionally pay visits to the Pokemon company, you know. Uh, go on, Cat. I'm sure that you will keep meeting countless Pokemon and people. Those encounters will keep thrilling you in their own special ways. I hope you'll enjoy that experience. Take care, cat. There, on. How did he get into the cavern? What Pokemon did he use for Surf? Yeah, so I think just like with Soul Silver, uh, Mesprit is not going to be randomized. Uh, just like with uh, Raikou and Entei. So we won't really bother with him. So the next spot we will go to is. Yeah, there's this Fuego Ironworks that we haven't checked out, but before we do that, let's go into uh, Lake Acuity. See what, um, what's randomized there. Yeah, this is where we caught uh, Kyogre in the Acuity Lakefront. Right, let's get... Oh, I can't use my bike, that's right in the snow. Oh, it's only getting deeper. Right, we can actually go up through here. Move it, move it, move it. Oh my god. Uh, it's not like, you know, the um, the bog in, was it, going up to um, near Pastoria City. It's not like that. You can't, you know, they, uh, rotate around the analog stick to get out of it. You're just stuck walking in it. Yeah, this is where we caught Kyogre. Level 21. Let's see if it's here again. Oh, hello. Level 30 that time. Jesus. We caught him level 21. Level 31 been bad now. He is in the Pokemon daycare. Along with uh, the Torterra we got. Right. Acuity Cavern. So, let's see what you're randomized to, uh, Uxie. Let's listen for the cry now. Caterpie. That's a Caterpie, folks. <laughs> a level 50 Caterpie. Curious to know what's going to evolve to. Right, this should be um, an alright catch, actually. Shouldn't take us too long. Barry, yeah, I should actually buy some Pokeballs. We could evolve this. It evolves at a very early level. Oh, you little shit. Bug bite. <laughs> a level 50 Caterpie. Yeah, unlike the uh, Soul Silver notes, like we randomized it to, yo, any Pokemon instead of legendaries. And there we go, we got it. That was quick. 
Curious to know what would evolve that if we had a rare candy. Right, Caterpie. It releases a stench from its red antenna to repel enemies. It grows by molting repeatedly. Right, what are we going to nickname Caterpie? A female Caterpie. Let's uh, look at the old uh, Pokemon name rater. You know, it's not going to make a difference. I'm not going to be using the thing. We'll be curious though, like, what will evolve to. But Prince of Brian, welcome. I can find that in Scar Pokemon Scarlet. Weevil. Oh, I, uh, Brady, welcome. Oh, I got that reference, yeah. Weevil. Isn't that, that's the character in Yu-Gi-Oh. He's got all the, uh, what, the uh, bug type cards? Yeah. Remember him. Yeah, Weevil it is. Uh, a bit late there, Grant. Yeah. Uh, welcome, by the way. Right, so that's that. Curious to know what was a uh, Carby evolved at. I know, like I said, there is a spot that we didn't um, check out here. Fuego Ironworks? I want to check that out before we uh, go on to the next lake. Yeah, we use Surf around here. Yeah, not a bad shout for the nickname, Brady. Not a bad shout now. Oh, feck off, will you? Right, surf along. Yeah, if we randomize the static Pokemon to like legendaries, I knew you would. Uh, <laughs> oh no! Oh, broken my hearty voice. Wait. Ah, it's yourself. No, we can't catch this, but yeah. No, we can't catch this. This doesn't count for an encounter, I don't think. Ro yeah, this is the roaming legendary. It's not randomized. Yeah, because it's level 50, see? Didn't think we would um, find it that soon. Jesus. Yeah, I'm going to run away from it. Because, yeah, we did catch the Pokemon in this route. Yeah, but that's kind of a shame, though. The, the, uh, the roaming uh, Pokemon, like Raikou, Entei... Uh, Latios, Latias, and Meesprit. They can't be randomized. It's kind of like with Groudon. Groudon can't... Not, not with Groudon. Uh, Giratina. Giratina couldn't be randomized in the Distortion World. Alright, Fuego Ironworks. We have not been here before, folks. So, might as well check it out. We'll see uh, what there is. In bloom. Right, let's see what our encounter is. Right here. It is... A Scorapy. I remember we got a Scorpy before in Soul of Silver and it evolved to Reg Ice. Yeah, again, I need to. Oh, I know what I could do. I know exactly what I could do here. I should have put him in front. Where is yourself? Yeah. Because here he has a false wipe and we can bring him down to 1 HP. Yeah, I, I never came across this spot at all. Like, even my regular copy of Platinum, I didn't know there was this spot at all. I just saw it on the map there. I was like, shit, we haven't been there yet. Right, there we go. Just make sure we actually get this. Wouldn't be bad, though. Like, see if what it evolved at. What level does it evolve? That's my question now. I'll use a great ball. Right, nicknames for Scorpy. I mean, I remember... When I caught it in Soul Silver, I named it Scorpio. Which I think that's what the nickname I'm going to go with. As soon as the tail uh, claw closed, its needles... Uh, tips secrete poison. It can survive a year without food. Fucking hell. Yeah, I'm gonna call it Scorpio. Uh, I'll, I'll spell it with a K. As in, you know, Scorpy. Scorpio it is. Yeah, I remember it evolved to Rag Ice in our Soul Silver Nuzlocke and had to rename it to what was it? Zub Zero. 
Right, one of us is here, out of curiosity. Nidorino. That would be not bad either, because we do have a Moonstone, I think, to evolve it. Oh well. Yeah, I wonder what, um, well, that's back to there. What is here, though? Let me have a look. It's like Team Rocket Hideout here. I've never seen this area. Is there a Pokemon here? It's already Pokemon here, is there? Oh, there's trainers here. Maybe we could, um, yeah, have a few battles here. All right, who am I going to put in front? No, that's Smokey. Someone who's actually, you know, close to leveling up. Yes, it is. Yeah, Scorpio. Wait, who we, you know, we'll push, uh, we'll push. All right. In front. Like, if these are trainers, they'll be probably low enough level here. Probably in the 30s. I work in the fiery foundry. You bet I'm hot and sweaty. Knees weak arms and heavy. <laughs> Port Alex. Ludicolo. Oh, Sergeant Ducky! It's Sergeant Ducky! Well, I want him back on the team. Ah. <gasps> oh. Level 33. Oh, I wish we had him back on the team. He was class in our, um... What was our, our Emerald Nozak? Right, next is Tropius. You know, I'm going to stay in, I think. Look at the banana chin on him. Don't think it's going to be super effective, though, is it? By the way, let me know how the game audio is. I burned out. Thank you for the money. Should I say I've racked up a lot of money here after um, all the grinding I've done. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh my goodness. Nearly I have 500k. Alright, let's see. We'll go up here. There's an item here. Could you imagine one of these is going to be the... Uh... What's new? Not much, uh, Demoy. Not much. We just found this area that I never saw before in Platinum. Was it Fuego Ironworks? So I will uh, check it out. We did get the encounter, which was a uh, Scorpy. And we checked out what was, um, well, two of the Pokemon that were, you know, randomized to, um, you know, from the Lake Trio. Well, actually, one of them was randomized. It was, Uxi was randomized to Caterpie, and we caught it. We called him Weevil. As in, like, the Yu-Gi-Oh character. Uh, Brady suggested it there. It was actually good, uh, a pretty good nickname. Well, it's not often we get a visitor like you to the Ironworks. Let's mark the occasion with a battle. Very well. So, um, the last one we're going to check out is Azelf. See what it's randomized to. Yeah, Meesprit can't be randomized. Apparently. Because it's just like, again, with Soul Silver, when I did the randomizer and that, Raikou and Entei, as they are random, like, you know, uh, roaming Pokemon, they can't be randomized. Which is kind of sad, really. I think it's the same thing with Pokemon Emerald. Shit, Dragon Rage. Oh, this is going to sting. Oh, you beauty. Yeah, I think it's the same thing with Emerald as well. Latios and Latias, they don't get randomized. Being their uh, roaming legendaries. But I think the same thing will happen with Cresselia, I think. Venusaur is next. No, we, we got something for Venusaur now. Oh, Venusaur fucking Kanja! Ganja who died. Oh my god, Ganja, I miss ya. Come back to haunt us, are ya? Through another trainer. Well, you're dead. Again. <laughs> yes. Hunt tail. Right. Let's bring it out. We all know what's coming here. We all know what's coming. Go! Alright! 
<laughs> oh, I love my soundboard. Oh, what's this now? Ah, notification on my phone, sorry now. So yeah, we're just doing some odd side things here and there first before we get to the the next city. Port Pansy. Fire him once more, only because I feel it. Yeah, I've never seen this area before in my life. Yo, know, like when I played, you know, Platinum originally. It's like I was just browsing around the map, you know, to fly to the next destination. And I just saw this area. It's like, how can we never seen this area before? Like, it's an optional area, of course, but yeah. I'm surprised the hell on me. Yeah, it's just like Team Rocket hideout with these damn tiles. Alright, I think it's true here now. I want that item. Oh, I see how we get it. Old Gatto. Oh, I don't want to get to him yet. I want to see what's over that other side. I'm going to stay night. Oh, excuse me. I laugh if we get a Master Ball. We already used it when we got um, Giratina. Which, yeah, for those who didn't watch, I did show it um, at the beginning of the stream. Yeah, yeah, Giratina wasn't randomized in the distortion world. So I said, fake, I'm just going to throw the Master Ball at it. Uh, Demoy, I think you've seen it as well, that, you know, uh, Drifloon was randomized to Mewtwo. I think I posted it in, like, um, you know, Gamertopia Facebook page that we're in. And I posted it in the Community Tab as well. <gasps> no fucking way! <laughs> Look! The memories. Oh, my God. I said, did I see it? Oh my sweet divine Christ. Oh, that is just fucking hilarious. Hope we get a master ball and lo and behold. <laughs> Question is, will we fucking use it? Alright, oh, love it. <laughs> right, how are we gonna get... How do we get up to this item here? Oh, I see how we do it. I see how we do it. Can't believe we just got the mask ball right there. Oh, it's a trainer here. Um, you know, we'll, we'll keep the rat in front. Are you maybe getting annoyed by where the floor panels take you? Yes, I am. It's starting to piss me off. Poet Rob or Bob Explode. Right, I'm gonna switch here. Um Jaden, get in there. Cannot believe we found a master ball. If our next encounter is the legendary. No. Be it the randomized A self or in the next route in that, we're using that motherfucker. Right, there we go. Going down in flames. Right, let's get this item here. Could you imagine this is another, like, Master Ball? Bright Powder. What does that do again? Bright Powder. Oh, pity I didn't uh, come across this area earlier in the uh, the Nuzlocke. I mean, we are getting experience regardless. Yeah, I saw. <laughs> Nine to be held by a Pokemon, it casts a tricky glare that lowers the opponent's accuracy. Demoy, are you kind of delayed in your uh, stream there? Um, another master ball. Yeah. Um, are you? You're probably a bit delayed on the on the stream there. If you hit the live thing 
on the um on the video itself, you should be up to speed with it. Yeah, I think you're about like a few seconds behind on it. Right now we gotta get this fecker here. Now how Oh hang on. Feck that brings us back. Obviously, you can't use the bike here, right? We fought you. I say there's another, another trainer there. I wonder what's there, though. Hang on now. Let's uh, top up the health of uh, Red. Got plenty of poisons. I'll probably be buying more once we get to uh, the Pokemon League. I'm losing my way. I hate these fucking tiles. Absolutely despise them. Yeah, we go th up through here, I think. And then we go through... Go through this way. Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. Yeah, if our next encounter is going to be legendary, yeah, we're using that bitch. For damn sure. Um, trying to trace my steps here on how we go about this. Well, that brings us back there. Yeah, I've never been in this area before, so like this is kind of new to me. No, we use that one. Fuck, I don't know. Hang on. Is it up through here now? Okay, there we go. Yeah. Mmm, fuck. Okay, we didn't do too much of a hiccup. Oh, I hate these fucking puzzles at times. I don't know what's worse. It's either this or using the uh, the ice uh, uh, puzzle, you know? Alright, there we go. Now, are you a trainer? Mr. Fuego, well, hello. It's not often I get a visitor here. I think it's the bottom one where you get three options. I tried to make the ironworks run better with the moving floor tiles. But no one was happy about it. They said the moving floor made them dizzy. Well, no fucking shit. But you don't want to listen to me whine. Here's a souvenir. A star piece. Ooh, get a bit of money for that. My ironworks makes iron by removing impurities from iron ore. In the process, we find a variety of colored shards. If you'd like, we can trade star pieces for these shards. Wait, do, do we even have shards? Oh, do we have any star pieces? Shadow Punch, alright, not bad. Even though we already have that on T1000. Right, there we go. Okay, that was a nice little bit of a detour there. And we got a Master Ball, so that was kind of worth it. Lovely stuff. Right, my flying bay. Let's go to, yeah, Veilstone. And what I'll do as well, I'll go to the uh, department store to get more Pokeballs and that. And obviously sell that Star Piece. Yeah, how is the audio, by the way? Is audio all good? Or there's the shop. So, yeah, we'll go to Lake Valor. See what Azelf is going to be randomized to. Let's buy... 
I think we'll go with the health stuff for now. Until we get to uh, the Pokemon League. Yep, all good here. Lovely stuff. I mean, look at all that money we got. Look at it. You're good. Awesome. Lovely stuff. Right. Let's sell this uh, star piece. Oh, wait. Oh, maybe. Oh, do you know what I did? I think I gave the star piece back to your man for the shards. Oh, fuck it, anyway. Well, we still loaded with dough, anyway. I thought it was the other way around. I thought he was looking for the shards for the star piece. That's why. Thought he was looking for. Ah oh, well. Right. On down to Lake Valor. Curious to see what is up is going to be randomized. Huh? Skip all this grass here. So what do you think, folks? Do you think we will get to the Pokemon League in this uh, stream? Or hell, even finish it. I think we might have a good chance at it. Hi, Ambipom. No. Oh, yeah, that's one thing I will do for... This next encounter, I will push T1000 in front because it's got false swipe. If it's something that we already have, we'll just kill it. I'm just thinking here, can we get an encounter? We can get a wild encounter here since there's water. Yeah, we can. There's grass as well. Right, what should we do? Should we do the grass encounter or the uh, water encounter? We've one badge left, Grant, and then it's the uh, the Pokemon League. But we're doing some uh, other things before we get to it. What do you think? Should we get a water encounter or grass encounter? Yeah, I'm just thinking here because the last time we did water, you say? Okay. Yeah, because I was thinking there, because with the water Pokemon, you can get up to level 30, I think. That's if there is any... <laughs> As you say, Brady. Wait for it, wait for it. We got Swalot. Level 27 Swalot. Okay. Body Slam. Alright, it's not the best, but not the worst either. It is a bit of a tank. I was going to flip a coin. <laughs> well, two set water already, so yeah. Um, yeah, we use the, the great ball here. We'll, we'll check out the grass as well, see what there is. Alright, there we go. Easy peasy. Right, what are we going to nickname Swalot? <laughs> it swallows anything whole. It, sweat, it sweats toxic fluids from its uh, phalluses to douse foes. Right, what are we going to nickname this yolk? <laughs> Any nicknames? Feel free to shout while I'm going to look at uh, Pokemon Name Rater. Watch the grass encounter be a legendary. Exactly, I, I, that's what I'm going to... <laughs> That's exactly what I'm thinking. Next one's like in the grass gonna be legendary. That mouth. <laughs> <laughs> right, I, I, yeah. Well, I'm just gonna, out of curiosity, what we got on uh, Pokemon Name Air. That mouth, okay, we got that. <laughs> Alright, I'm just scrolling down here. It takes a while to scroll down to the Pokemon you're looking for. Swalot. So we got that mouth. Guma. A uh, uh, Guma is pretty good too. All right, Swalot, Swalot, Swalot. Here we go. So we got penis. 
<laughs> Charlie. Oh, there's not really many, many good nicknames. All right, I think I'm gonna go with Guma. Sorry, Demoy. Yeah, I think Guma's pretty good. That mouth. <laughs> right, so there's that. Let's check out what we got in the grass. Yeah, I'm going with Brady here. I'm thinking it's going to be like a legendary. It's going to be low level though, compared to what you find in the in the grass. All right, let's see what we got here. Louder, level 40, holy fuck. Well, it wouldn't have been, uh, wouldn't have been great, but like level 40. Let's see what else there is. Oh, an item. So we got Loudreds. Cacnea. All right, that could evolve. Yeah, I didn't think there were gonna be level 40 Pokemon here. I thought there were gonna be like level 30. Lord of shite, I'm gonna sell that for a bit of Bob. Right, what else have we got? I'm just waiting for the legendary. <laughs> just waiting for the legendary now. We got Tropius. Oh, I remember we got Tropius in, what was it, Fire Red? What we call it? Not the Mama. Oh, it's not the Mama. Oh, I would have loved that as our encounter. Yeah, I remember that. We call that not the mama. You know the dinosaurs reference? Oh, still though. There he goes. Right. So there's the uh, the grass Pokemon in Lake Valor. We will go on to see what Azelf is. What else is here actually other than Swalot? Nor Swalot, right. Kind of feel bad now that we didn't do the grass encounter. Because, yeah, not the mama. <laughs> yeah, Brady, I think you were the one who suggested that nickname back then. Right. Valor Cavern, right. So. Azelf. Alright, this isn't for the coin now. Corsola. It's a bit disappointing. Yeah, not gonna lie, I'm... Yeah, it, it's not great, is it? Although, it can tank a few hits. It's got fucking Aqua Ring. Yeah, it kind of sucks. Well, then again, uh, Ooxie sucked as well, because we, um... It was, watch God, Carpy. Although, we can evolve Carpy. I see we can catch this, like, right off the bat here. Doesn't have that low of a catch rate. Yeah, we'll catch it right away. Alright, there we go. Didn't need to weaken it at all. Right, Corsola. Yeah, not the best. Many live in the clean seas of the south. They apparently can't live in polluted waters. Right, where are we going to nickname Corsola? Even though we're not going to use the fucking thing. Now get Pokemon. Yeah, pretty. Yeah, I think Corsola is female only. I was going to say, like, if it was male, we could call it Cory. Made a grave mistake, Corey. Come on, why can't you... Oh, this fucking phone at times. And this is a new phone. Right, let's see. Corsola. What are we going to nickname it? Corsola, there you are. What's there's going to be like... Um, Coraline? I like Coraline. That's actually pretty cool. Reefer, Corroso, Coral, well that's obvious. Reef. Yeah, I'm gonna call it Coraline. That's actually, um, <laughs> that's actually pretty clever. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's a, a Pokemon that's actually tough to think of a nickname for. 
Right, and out we go. On to our next destination, folks. Yeah, I think that was a nice little detour before we get to the next gym. I think we have a new route coming up as well. Coraline is actually my favorite stop motion film. Oh, that's right. It is a um, that is a film. Yeah. Hang on now. What is up here? Huh, oh, nothing. Oh, yes. One thing I want to do around here before we go on to the next route. See all these items here. We do have rock climb, so let's uh, let's check them out. Let's check out these items. If we can get them. Oh, there we go. There we go. No. Yeah. Right, I'm going to use the, the dowsing machine as well while we're at it. Oh, wrong thing. Alright, let's head on down. Funny, you think there'd be something here. Oh, there's another rock climb thing. Look, you just kind of notice the little um, little dots. What about around here? Um, let's get this. All right, nothing. I think we can walk past them trees, can we? Fuck! How do we? Hang on now. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Get these two items. See what they are out of curiosity, right? Escape rope. Could come in handy. And... Gunk shot. Okay. Not too shabby. I think there's one other item we can get. Yeah, a bit much rock climbing to get to um, this area here. I think there's one more item. I think we have to go out to the um, out of the area, Route Two One Three. I think. Let me just double check. We got the two items here. Yeah, there's one there, I believe, around here. I think. I thought there was an item here. Or maybe not. Ah, well. Maybe I accidentally got off stream and I don't know what it is. Right, we will head on now. We can actually go by here now. And this is a new route, folks. New encounter. Now, right, I'm going to go into the grass for this one, since we already did the water one. Right, let's be having you. Our encounter is Route 222. A toga tick. Okay. Okay, uh, that's not too shabby. Trouble is, though, toga tick evolves uh, through friendship, if I remember correctly, right? No, I won't follow you. Let's chip it down little by little. Yeah, keep using safeguard. Um Yeah. Yeah, little bastard. Ancient power. Yeah, I'm just gonna get Pokemon near me already. Feel free to chime in with nicknames when we catch this. There we go. Caught a Toga Tech. Pity wasn't Toga Kiss though, because Toga Kiss is actually a fucking unit. 
No. Eggsy, you say? To share his happiness, it flies around the world seeking kind-hearted people. You say Eggy? Or Eggsy? Right, I'm gonna scroll down Pokemon name here. So we got Eggsy. See what Pokemon name here has. Probably doesn't have much, does it? Eggbert. <laughs> I like Eggbert. Uh, took a tick. There we go. Let's have a look here. Joy. Why center it? Miss uh, Fortune. Gospel. Toga Wee. <laughs> Hikari. Hmm. Uh, kind of like Fortune. I do like Fortune. Sorry now, but I think Fortune is um is a good one. Some fucking unit. Yeah, Token Kiss is pretty much a unit. I'm gonna call it Fortune. Right, let's see what else there is out of curiosity. Well, we already caught one of them, so screw that. We call it what? Fat Tammy? Let's see if there's a hidden nightmare. Again, that would be one we already caught. We call it uh, Cacleon. We call it Chameleon. Right, I'm just going to see here. Is there a hidden item here? You'd think with a gap like this, there would be. Oh, there is? Oh, it's up in the next area. Right up here, I think. A nugget. Oh, we could sell that for a bit of bob. What about around here? Lovely stuff. That's five grand. Zigzagoon. Pretty shit Pokemon here in all fairness. We got Toga Tick though. I think that's the best out of the bunch. Fucking Zigzagoon. Or as I call him Rigby. And we get Articuno then and call him Mordecai. Yeah, fake off you fat York, you. Alright, that is that. Right, let's start uh, battling a few trainers here. I need to escape these uh, doll drums. You can keep me company. Dr. P. Oh, hello, Mewtwo. Frieza. Oh, we're not gonna... We're not gonna, you know, worry. Because we know the ability that Mewtwo has, Truant. We could take this down easy peasy. Oh, you little bastard. Get the crit, come on. This will be good experience, so. Miracle Eye. Huh, <laughs> Jesus. Wasted his turns there. To, like, Jesus. With a Mewtwo. Still, look at that experience. Give me that, Dr. P. Fork over the door. Or as I have in the soundboard here. Show me the blade money! That would have been a great catch. What, Mewtwo? But we already caught Mewtwo that has um, Truant. What do we have here? What is this? Pikachu fan club. Okay. Well, we have a few uh, battles here. A few trainers to battle here. Or, yeah. And it has that shit ability, Truant. Where it attacks one turn, but then it doesn't. It says loafing around.
gather these berries anyway. Right, let's fight this bitch first. And we'll t tackle the ones in the, uh, the lower path then. After enjoying a meal at the hotel restaurant, one has a battle. That's the social etiquette. I'll give you a fucking social etiquette. Author Mike. Weavile. Well, we should be okay. Oh, hang on now. No, we won't be actually, because it's dark type, right? Dark ice type. Jaden. Should go down easy to our aura sphere. I like Weavile. Weavile's class. This is a cool Pokemon. Alright, there we go. Enchanting. Damn right. Do we go into a new route here? Look, there's all this grass here. Oh, I have a security guard. What's well, that item there as well? I'm gonna get that item. Adamant Orb. Oh, that's for uh, the Alga. So we got the Lustrous Orb and the Adamant Orb. Oh, what does that mean? I know the post game you can actually encounter them in the Spirit Pillar. Hi, Traveler. Would you like to battle? Sure, why not? Fisherman. Or what are you? Weightlifter. Dudley. All right, Groot. Sucker punch. Okay, ow. We do outspeed. I think we're a bit over level for these bunch. Although the daily trainers have kind of upped the levels now. They're up to level 47 in some of them. Bennett is next. Good chance it. Shadow Punch. There we go. Super effective. Thought I was gonna like live in the red and then it would just body me then. You've bested this fisherman, traveler. Damn right. Right, we're gonna Let's see, we'll probably heal up here. Wool gash oh. It heals all the saddest problems of a single Pokemon. Ah, oh, so it's like a full heal. And we'll give one to Jaden as well. Hmm. You know what, fuck, I'll top up the lot. We got plenty of potions to go. And we'll definitely be buying a lot more. I'm getting bored of fishing. Let's have a quick battle. If you say so. Your funeral. It's got four Pokemon on him. Weightlifter Sonya. Murkrow. Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch out here. I don't think any of my attacks could take it down. Right. You know who we're gonna bring in? Bring out the Right. <laughs> mean look at feck off. They ain't gonna do shit. Who says I'm gonna be escaping? Eh? Level 53 for Schmokey. Gabite is next. Alright, Dragon Zord, you got this. That's never getting old. <laughs> well, that's good. That's good as not getting old. Alright.
Yeah, with the orb we have on Dragon's Zord, he's gonna be a fucking powerhouse. Mew is next. Uh, Mew. Little Mew. Right. Um, T1000. Then again, we could have went back to Rash again because he got Signal Beam. Look at Mew. How could you not like it? Remember we caught one in Soul Silver? Didn't really last long. Oh she's metronome. That's solar beam. That is solar beam. Get it! <laughs> yeah, remember we caught one in Soul Silver, didn't last long, we called it Jesus. Yeah, die to a trainer's Pokemon. And we said, you fucking Judas. <laughs> right, Ursa Ring is next. Right, Blaziken, you can just double kick this to death. Bear. We got a flying bear. Or, or a seer. That's brilliant, though. <laughs> Alright, specifically remember the trainer was. It's the trainer that's next to, you know, the tree that's Sudowoodo. Isn't that route? I've been done in. I find myself randomly saying th uh, that out loud and lol, I'm blaming you. What? Well, <laughs> awesome. <laughs> right, we're gonna give the experience share to someone else. Can't believe I found a fucking Master Ball again. Um, yeah, we'll give it that. Right, who's close to leveling up? Both rat is or rat. Oh, if we had Dialga and gave him that, it'd be something else. We'll put someone else in front. Ah, oh, some bird. Get you in there. Unless this guy has a grass Pokemon in front, we're switching. Well, I am fishing, but very well. I accept your challenge. Like you had a choice. Weightlifter Jacqueline. <laughs> we got this in the bag. Geo dude. Right, mud bomb. Yeah, we got earthquake on uh, Poseidon here, which is gonna be freaking OP. Shaman next. Ah, the shaman. Blaziken. We're seeing Shaman a lot in this Nuzlocke. Being wild encounters and now in wild, um, in um, trainer battles. Look at the Shaman. That's the second mythical, like, in less than five minutes. We've seen Mew and now Shaman. Well, it's gonna be dead. And we caught one as well, which is awesome. Named the Shayla. Next up is Mantike. We all know what's going to be brought out here. Here we go. Go! Alright! <laughs> Some people are going to be sick and tired of me doing that, but... Fuck it. Here we go. Bear sweet smile is on my lips. Well, you lost, lad. If I stare at the water surface for too long, I begin to forget what I was doing in the first place. Another fisherman. Pansy. Or weightlifter. Sunflora. Right, we're switching. I live on a pond uh, now, and it would should be a fun summer. Just need to get to know my neighbors so they don't think some rando is fishing in their pond. Yeah, we're switching here. Uh, I suppose Jaden. Yeah, Leaf Storm. That would have definitely hurt Poseidon. 
That's really the only downside with Swampers. Like, four times weak to grass, you know? That really is the only downside. Other than that, he's a fucking awesome Pokemon. Grovile is next. Oh my god. Again, it's like a reunion of the Holland starters right here. We got Swampert in the team, we got Blaziken, and here's Grovile, like, in the uh, trainer battle. Again, yeah, we've been seeing that a lot. We've seen a lot of the, uh, the Horn starters. Oh, jeez, that was a crit. Oh, don't miss this. Ron Jaden. Not only that, our star Pokemon was a Venusaur. So, yeah. We've seen a lot of grass Pokemon in the randomizer. Level 53 for... Wait for it. Alright. He's got another Sunflora. What the fuck? Two Sunfloras and a Grovile. They've come back to haunt you. <laughs> yeah, that's two Sunfloras. For a guy who's a fisherman. No water Pokemon at all. I don't know how, but I lost. Hey, look at the Pokemon you had. It's all about knowing your, um, your super effective moves. Right, let's take this off you. Give you back the light ball. I think... Huh, let me just, like, look again. I suppose give it to Poseidon because he's close to leveling up. Might as well top of the health of Jane as well. He goes, you're not doing so hot here. That leaf blade was super, not super effective, but critical. Critical. We'll keep using the super potions. Now, now we got this little one here. What do you want? Listen, listen, can you tell me what kind of Pokemon you have? Oh, you'll see. Won't tell ya, I'll fucking show ya. Okay then! This bitch! What Pokemon you have? Oh, I have a Dialga! Fuck off! Well, it's super dead. <laughs> I don't know why, but the uh, the the noise of Dialga's cry is weird to me. It sounds like an elephant taking a crusty dump. That kid wants smoke. It fucking does. <laughs> yeah, that's not why I always thought like Dialga's cry sounds like. It's like a elephant taking a crusty dump. Oh, I forgot about you. When I first started fishing, catching anthem made me happy, but those days are long gone now. Now I get annoyed if I can't beat my record by even an inch. Oh, I thought he was going to give me, um, Super Rod. We got item in there. Let's see what we got here. I know, like, this is still the same route. Yeah, it's all the same, I think. That kid did want to smoke. Ah, uh, fucking berry. Oh well. I'm seeing another item there. Ah, uh, the eagly buff. Yeah, the bloody baby Pokemon. Like, they evolve through friendship, which is probably the most annoying way to evolve a Pokemon. I don't know, there's some more Pokemon that are kind of worth it, you know, in terms of leveling up by friendship. Crobat is definitely one of them. Yo, Crobat is freaking awesome. Or as I call him, um, when I nickname him, Alucard. That's why yeah, I call it. Remember we got one Mazda in Brilliant Diamond. I was actually so so happy that we got that. And pretty early. I thought I was going to get that much later like in the game. But I actually got pretty early. Uh, yeah, we'll keep Jaden in front. The only items you ever throw are Pokeballs. But is that true? I want people to think about that. 
That's why I give away the technical machine fling. Oh, let's see what this actually is. Using that move, the Pokemon hurls whatever item is holding at the foe. The move's effect depends on what item is hurled. Alright, let's see what um, TM56 actually is. Toxic. Okay. Right, this security guard. Yeah, you only fight them at night. Who's there? What do you think you're doing? Who's there? Go away! Fan Mike. Vigoroth. Oh, we can deal with that. Hey, look, it's, um, Slim Tony. Or Fit Tony. <laughs> All right, critical hit. There we go. Lotad is next. Rip Tony to go. Yeah, he was the best. Like out of all the uh, the deaths that happened against Rayquaza, that one kind of hurt me the most because he got us out in a lot of jams. Really did. He's a fucking unit as well. I know you're probably saying like, wouldn't that be like Gangasaur? No, Fat Tony. Fat Tony was much more of a go, I think. But well, we've seen that there was Fit Tony there. All right, this is a double battle. Let's see now. We'll give Jane a break. We'll put in the, the Dragon Zord. Look, look, look at my Pokemon. It's really cool. Oh, we'll see. Is it Dialga again? Oh, we'll ride upon the sea in a boat. Just you and me. That's the way of the sailor. Way of the sailor. Uh, sing it. No, I won't sing it. Juggler Joe and Engineer Scott. Pikachu and fucking Moltres. I think if I ever call it Moltres, um, what nickname would I go with it? I think I'd probably call it Jean Grey. You know, as in, you know, Phoenix. We should take these down. Yeah, I think that would be a good nickname for, for Moltres. I would call it Jean Grey. You know, as in the Phoenix. Oh, by the way, who has seen the recent episode of X-Men 97? This is out today. These kids and their legendary Pokemons. I think this is a, um, the Sailor's one. I think this is the sailor's one. Uh, the little kid had a, um, had a Pikachu. Because like the legendary Pokemon is on the same side as uh, as the sailor. That's how I see it. Poseidon grows to level 53, nice. I still haven't seen it. What's the streaming on? Um, Disney Plus. It's on Disney Plus. Yeah, a lot of things have um, have kind of revealed, like from the previous episode. Black glasses. Oh, that's to power up uh, dark moves, if I recall. Jeez, we're hour in already. Fucking hell. Actually, it doesn't feel that long. In all fairness. Right, we got this one sailor here. Um, oh yeah, I'll change around the experience here. You know, it's funny too, I won't say any spoilers to that, but there's a character that's uh, been uh, brought in. And I kind of kind of should have realized that they were going to bring in this character because she was partly spoiled by a Funko figure. That was revealed of her. Yeah, I think I'll give it to Jane the experience here. Again, I'm not going to speak too much about it because, you know, some people have not seen it yet. 
It is awesome, Demoy. I think you should definitely check it out. My dream's a big one. I want to battle every kind of Pokemon from around the world. Well, you're going to eat them words because, uh, look what you're going to be facing. Eh, uh, fanfi. Let's kill it. <laughs> the wee elephant. The wee effilant. Endure. Endure all you want. You're going down. Oh, I lived on one. And that was a crit as well. Right. You little shit. How's the fucking... Oh, Spain... <laughs> Dragon Sword. Oh, there we go. I think Endure is like a first turn move all the time, isn't it? Prank me if I'm wrong. Shockle. Oh, we caught one of them. We called the Fuckle. <laughs> Good old Shuckle. Yeah, because I remember Sergeant Ducky. He caught one as well in his uh, Ruby Nuzlocke. He named it um, Suckle. I caught mine and called it Fuckle. Not watch it yet. Wait until nearly all episodes are out. Then I'll binge watch it. Fair enough. Oh, of course of that. And we caught one of them. Yeah, stay in his Dragon Zord. How do you miss? Jesus. That was a crit. Fucking hell. Simmer down. Yeah, do that all you want. Ain't gonna save you. All right, there we go. There we go. Engineer Donna. I lost by him one step close to realizing my dream. Well, you've seen uh, Palkia anyway. I still can't figure out these trees. I remember I put honey on this tree before and, well, in a, another area. Uh, I know cone bees are supposed to come out of it or for your wild encounter. Don't know how it works. Yeah, it's either honey on it. Like, are you supposed to, like, come back and then there's a, a combi? Let me just double check here. Because I thought it was like, you put it on for the day, then come back the next day. And, yeah, you get the, uh, the combi then. Sunny Shore's gym leader, uh, Valkner, been bored lately, I hear. We need tough challengers to visit so he doesn't get bored. People get up to no good if they have too much time on their hands. If I had to describe Sunny Shore Gym in a word, it'd be shockingly electric. Whoops, that's two words. You idiot. There we go. Oh, hello. Oh, he's off the, uh, the Leaf War. Yo, fellow trainer. Your Pokemon are secure inside their Pokeballs, but there's no masking uh, that aura of serious toughness. Oops, sorry, I should introduce myself. The name's Flint. I'm one of the Pokemon League's Elite Four. I just had this idea. Maybe you can pull it off. It's about this town's gym leader. He's really lost his enthusiasm lately because there's uh, there have been so few good challengers for his time. He's been so bored, he spends all his time renovating the gym. But then the blackout happened. That sure didn't help lift his mood. You know where I'm going with this, don't you? I need you to give him a battle that's so hot it will reignite his passion for battling. I'm counting on you, hot shot. But we'll give him a fight. I think we can get an encounter here. Well, we can't around this part because it's all blocked off by the fence. Right, we'll be getting our uh, last gym badge. <clears throat> Oh, excuse me. Yeah, when it comes to X-Men 97, I'm just going to watch it episode by episode. I'm already hooked on it. Yeah, I think further up there is uh, there's a way we can fish for an encounter. Wait, what is this? 
What do we have here now? Oh, your Palkia. It works stupendously hard, didn't it? As a reward, uh, please give it this effort emblem. Or effort ribbon. Okay. What do we have here? I don't need any of that. I love tap toys. Plaza games are great too. I'm a huge fan of the Wi-Fi Plaza, so I'm promoting it on my own. Fair play to you. Yeah, I think there's an area we can uh, we can fish somewhere. It's all these fucking fences here. Wherever the environment, people and Pokemon adapt to live there. That's what we all do to survive. Oh, it's yourself. It's uh, Jasmine. This city makes me feel at home somehow. It's next to the sea and there's a lighthouse. Oh, just like in El, um, what was it? Olivine City? Well, if you don't have the gym badge, you'll be forced to turn back. Right, I think we can get a no, fishing encounter here. So, uh, why not? Let's see what we'll get. I'd laugh if it's the legendary. Um... Get me key items. Yeah, we don't have the super rod. We've only the old rod and the good rod. Where do you get the super rod, in all fairness? Oh, well. Let's see what we'll get. Not even a nibble. Okay. We'll keep at it. We'll keep at it. Oh. Land of the Pokemon. Right. Music's regular. Jirachi! Hello! Alright, alright. It's not like we're going to be using it, but... Hey. Mythical. And being that it's a mythical, I don't think it's going to be tough to catch. It's, what, steel... It's steel psychic. I know that. And you have to be confused. Jesus. No, don't you dare. I fucking hate confusion at times. Or being confused. Confusion as a move is pretty damn good. Want to just use false swipe and just get it down to 1 HP? Won't use a Master Ball because I think it, the thing is that mythical Pokemon are easier to catch than, you know, uh, actual legendaries. Come on. There you go, lad. But then again, this thing has... Rest. Okay, it's got Swift, Rest, Confusion. Right, I'm gonna chuck a Ultra Ball. Okay, you're gonna put up a bit of a fight here. Swift away, boy. Swift away. Snap that confusion, that's the way to be. Go on. One HP. What's well, gonna use rest and then it's gonna go to sleep and refill his health. One. Two. Helping hand. Alright, that's his fourth move. Yeah, we won't use the Master Ball. Right, there we go. Rest. This what? Gonna be our second Mythical if we catch this. This should be handy now because if we get it with another false Swipe and it's asleep, we'll definitely have a chance in catching it. Right, nickname suggestions for uh, Jirachi. 
There's one nickname I have in mind, but it's actually from Irish Emerald. Uh, who used to do uh, Nuzlocke's. He called us Starman. Then again, we could just look at the name writer. Oh, you think things uh, put up a fight here? Again, we won't use the uh, the master ball. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm just gonna scroll down here. One, two, three. Yeah. Bastard. Right, Jirachi, let's see. Oh, I skipped up by it there. Jirachi, where are you? Jirachi. Nearly there. <laughs> right. Have the page ready. Yeah, Starman is one nickname, but again, that's going from Irish Emerald. Don't want to steal his uh, nickname, if you know what I mean. Mess resting again. Yeah, level 17. Would take a fair bit to, uh, you know, grind it up. Come on, we got this. 77 Ultra Balls, come on. We got this. Again, like, folks, I'm not going to use the uh, the Master Ball because, yeah, I mean, it's a mythical. Mythical are easier to catch than legendaries. I mean, we caught bloody Shaman, you know, without using the Master Ball. I mean, for a Pokemon that's like level 17 as well. Right, come on. Bag. <sighs> come on, Jirachi. Stop being the little bollocks. Jeez, it wakes up fairly quickly now. Just looking up nicknames here. If you could get in the ball, Jirachi. Superstar, I see one of them there. It's actually not bad. Someone says um, Harley because it kind of looks like a Harlequin. I don't know about that. Um... A few pages there. Supernova was pretty good. Oh my god, that was a crit. Nice. All right, let's see if we can catch a while as asleep. Star Kid. Ah, oh, will you come on? Giraffe. <laughs> Giraffe. <laughs> Wishmaker, Stardust, Stardust ain't bad. Oh my god, Star Dude, Sakura, um, Sirachi, Starbucks, <laughs> Starbucks. <laughs> That's actually pretty, pretty cool, <laughs> pretty funny. Uh, what else is there? Orion, Kirby. No, no, about Kirby now. Kind of like in Superstar. Fuck, 
Funny there's no Starman. Funny that's not a nickname someone did. Ziggy. God, why is this being a pain to catch? You're a mythical. You're supposed to be easier than legendaries to catch here. And I'm one HP as well. Come on. We could try other Pokeballs, but I think Ultra Ball is the way to go. This is what's going to pad out the stream here. Just trying to catch this fucking Jirachi. Yeah, again, we'll false swipe. Because definitely Shadow Punch would kill it and Cycle Cut. Crit, nice. Lovely stuff. Um, let's try a Timer Ball, actually. Oh, for fuck's sake. You think that would work? I think that would work now. Um, netball. Somewhat different Pokemon that works especially well on water bug type. Nah. Let's try a Pokeball. <laughs> Just for shits and giggles. Could you imagine we actually catch in a Pokemon though? Nope. Nope. Oh, this is going to drag on. Yeah, it's either Superstar or Stardust. Either of them two kind of piques my interest for nickname. 69 Ultra Balls. Come on. My brother caught a Groudon with a Netball, which was hilarious. Jesus. Yeah, Demoy, remember in our uh, Emerald Randomizer? Magic Carp evolved uh, to a Groudon. That was hilarious too. Like Stardust. Stardust is yeah, a good nickname. Sick. Why is this not getting in the ball? Yeah, I think you were on that stream, weren't you? When... Magikarp, we call it Hope. <laughs> we uh, we evolved it to a Groudon. <laughs> My god, why are you not fucking staying? Jeez, it wakes up fairly quick, doesn't it? It really does wake up fairly quick now. I remember, yeah. There was one shake there. Yeah, helping hand. You're not going to get help, are you? You're getting caught, whether you like it or not. Fucking little bastard. Is it really that tough to catch? You know, being it's a mythical. I mean, I know we're not going to use it, but... It'd be nice to catch it. Swift. How many kinds of monsters has this yolk drank? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> yeah, it wakes up really quickly after a rest. Watch, when you dive underwater there, you just see loads of cans of monster <laughs> where he was, like, living. 
Jesus Christ, we are going through the Ultra Balls like crazy here. Bastard. Kind of hoping I would just use rest again. Jeez, like, don't... I can believe that, yeah. <laughs> Come on. Scan the damn ball, dude. I know, right? I I'm not going to resort to using the Master Ball. I'm not. I know we can catch this in, yo, know, Ultra Ball. Confusion. It could end up fucking running out of moves and, you know, you struggle and then die. Which, if it does, that'll suck. Dipstick, come on. You know, funny too, when I was like catching that Mewtwo, that was the Drifloon. Yeah, it took me a couple of tr attempts with that as well. And that was level 15. Oh, for... Right, folks, I'm going to be right back because I need to use the toilet so I won't be long. Time to take a piss. Right, and back, let's continue. Probably after that wee piss, piss break, we could uh, cash this now. <laughs> ah, could you imagine we catch it after the piss break? Oh, I think it's really at the point now it's gonna like run out of moves. Jurassic, for the love of fuck. Fuck a Pokeball. Got one shake. Got one shake. You're not getting any help, lad. Two shakes. Price hasn't gone for rest yet. Oh god. It'd be hilarious if we do catch in a Pokeball. <laughs> Brilliant. Caught in the Pokeball. Finally. And yes, to quote the rock. Finally! We got it. The Wish Pokemon. It is said to have the ability to grant any wish for just one week every thousand years. Alright, what are we going to nickname Jirachi? So, two names of mine. Stardust or Superstar? Um, I think, yeah. Uh, Demo, you were saying Stardust. I think, Brady, you said the same, right? Sometimes the original is always best, yes. <laughs> Right, so anyone else? Yeah, it's definitely Superstar or Stardust that, you know, are pretty good. I think, yeah, Stardust because I like the film. 
When I think Stardust, I think of that gimmick uh, Call Your Oats had. <laughs> yeah, um, I think Brady, you said uh, Stardust as well, right? Yeah, I think you did. Right, we'll go with Stardust. Alright, there we go. Not like we're going to be using it anyway, but eh, it is an encounter. Call it in the Pokeball of all things. After all them uh, attempts with the Ultra Ball. It's like you said, sometimes the original is always the best. Alright, so... With that out of the way, we can uh, go on to the next gym now. The last gym. Get the show on the road. No sign of our uh, rival yet. Does he show up here, actually? Oh, this is the gym. Oh, your man's blocking it, though. That giant rock, isn't it really a Pokemon? That's what I know. Choice band. Oh, don't we have to find the, uh, the gym leader somewhere? That glaring, uh, bright and cool thing you have. It's undoubtedly a Pokesh, the latest model, no less. They're awesome, yeah? I got okayed by the Pokemon company to develop original Pokesh apps. Hey, you're a trainer, right? Can you do me a favor? You've got a Pokemon with different natures, right? May I see them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we have to show them Pokemon of serious nature. Yeah, I think you have to find the gym leader somewhere. If I remember correctly. Oh, he's in the lighthouse, right? Vista lighthouse. The gym leader uses too much electricity. He needs to think about the city's power needs too. Going up. <clears throat> right, I think that's him there, isn't it? So you're the latest challenger up against the Sunny Shore gym. Alright, I've decided. If I find you to be weak, I'm going to challenge the Pokemon League. I'm all done with renovating the gym, so I don't need to be here. More than anything, I want to have battles that can thrill me again. As the toughest gym leader in Sinnoh, I'm going to unleash everything in my arsenal on you. Very well. What's in the binoculars? Hmm. I love how far away you can see with the binoculars. I'm going to go that far away with my Pokemon one day. The Visa Lighthouse represents safety and protection to us sailors. That it does. Right, down we go. Time for the last gym, folks. You're nearly two hours in, all because of that feckin' Jirachi. What's up here now? What are, what are these? Delightful ribbons for Pokemon. I couldn't give a shit about that. I mean, what's our Pokemon like? Did we... Might as well... Yeah, I'm gonna heal up. Just gonna heal up just in case. I think we're going the potion end. We need plenty of money to buy more anyway. I think then when we get to the Pokemon League, we get full restores, which are going to be super handy. We need plenty of money for it too. So I don't know what this uh, yo, this gym leader is going to be like. What's What level is his ace? We're definitely going to be up to the 50s, I take it. Right, you. Yo, hiya, he's finally come back. He seemed to be feeling upbeat too. I have a hunch that he recognized your toughness right away. I bet he's getting excited over the thought of battling you. Remember what you have to do, hotshot. 
Give me a give him a battle that's so hot it will reignite his passion for battling. Alright, Hasha, I'll be waiting at the Pokemon League. Alright, good luck. Now. Oh, I remember this. It's all coming back to me. Right, who do we have with the experience share? Jaden. Nearly close to leveling up. I swear to God, if one of these has a fucking Rayquaza. That's the last thing I feckin' want. I see how this works. There we go. Yeah, we'll keep dragging the door in front. Can you make it to the gym leader? You sure now? Fisher Landon. All right, eleven forty-seven. Off to an all right start, I think. You special rent. All right, there we go. The gear spin round and round. I spin in around. I oh, don't know what she said because the text went so fucking fast. You remember this one kind of being a bit of a pain. Hang on now. I think. Oh, we have to go up here first, I think. Well, there's a trainer here anyway. I want to win. That desire I pour into my guitar. I want to win. That compa that passion compels my Pokemon. Does it now? Artist Mike. Needle Queen. My dragon claws. And slowly, slowly, boom. Jane grew to level 53. Awesome. Regirock is next. Alright, we're gonna switch. I'm gonna get Poseidon in here. Well, we should be good for this. We got Earthquake, so yeah. She'll go down one hit. Going, going. Oh, you motherfucker. Hard to believe to survive that now. Right, surf's up, bitch. Right, there we go. Another one bites the dust. Jeez, get good experience with that now. Belossum is next. Uh, let's go with... Alright! Every time. Dwayne Johnson lives up to his name. <laughs> yeah, Dwayne the Reggae Rock Johnson. <laughs> the final boss. That's actually what I would nickname Regirock if we ever caught one. Dwayne. Okay, let's see here. Can we figure this out? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Now. Yourself. 
Oh, I forgot to switch around the... Oh, we'll do it later. This is the toughest gym in Sinnoh. That's why I'm here to learn the best battle techniques around. Oh, yeah. See about that. Fisher Joy. Oh, Drifloon. Take this down easily. X speed, all oh, you little shit. Not gonna do you any good, though. Get out of here. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Boom. Awesome. Yeah, I need to switch around the experience here. <clears throat> Give it to someone else. Right, so we have it on Jaden. We'll give you back the the fist plate. And I think out of the two. Yeah, we're going to give it to T1000. We'll keep the orb on Pelkia. Or Dragon Zord, I should say. Yeah. There we go. Now. Oh, the Pikachu up there. Oh, it's a little kid. Little furry. There we go. Yeah, look at it. Look at the way I'm dressed. Can't you see that I'm hardcore? You're furry. Look at you. Cool trainer, Scott. Megby. Hey, look, Firequacker Jr. Right, next up is Reshikesh. Reshikesh. Look, folks, it's Jared Lee, so. Alright! <laughs> and down goes Jared Leto. Right, next up, Explode. This should be a clean sweep here. I'm... <laughs> Yeah, Demoy, I have to show you the uh, the video that I got that sound from. It's not on uh, YouTube or anything. I got it from uh, Facebook. Oh, Carapy's next. Just caught one of them. Should be easy peasy. There we go. Yeah, I'm curious to know what Carapy's going to evolve to. Yeah, I'll, I'll send it on to you after uh, after the stream. I'll skip the dialogue there, but like I give a fuck. Oh god, this is where it gets fucking tedious. Whether you're a trainer on a or a guitarist, it takes dedication to improve your match skills. He's right there. No argument there. Artist Rachel. Carnivine. And wait for it. Going, 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 gun. Critical hit two. My skills seem to have let me down. Must have been out of tune. Yeah, I think. Is this the final area? Oh, I remember this being a pain in the dick. All right. Yeah, we got somehow, or maybe, hang on, there we go. I'm not just looking for tough trainers to battle, I've been battling here because I want to feel the rush.
Schoolboy Thomas. Cacturn. You know, I was actually looking at what nickname would be good for uh, Cacturn. What about uh, Cactur from Final Fantasy? I think that would be a good nickname. That or even Scarecrow, because looking at it, it is, you know, the shape of a Scarecrow. But Cactur from Final Fantasy, that's actually, you know, a good nickname for it. Yeah, one of my friends, uh, she does, um, you know, she does artwork. And I think she was mentioning about, you know, um, she did, I think she did an art piece of, like, Cactur with Sudowoodo. And, yeah, I mean, like, for Sudowoodo, that is a good nickname, too. Uh, Cactur. Pupitar is next. All right, we can stay in. That is a good nickname, yeah. Well, we caught uh, Sudowoodo already. We call it uh, Groot. Yeah, same friend who um, who painted this for me, the bob -on Battlefield uh, painting behind me. Oh yeah, I gotta check this out. Um, never looked at... Um, see, well, thing mark. Yeah, Cat's Corner. That's uh, who uh, did it there. I wonder will... Oh, you see, I changed from Stream Elements to Stream Labs. I want to see if it actually work. If it doesn't, shite. Yeah, we're getting up to the gym leader now. Spark. This is what our gym leader did to the gym out of boredom. Yeah, I really gotta check that stream labs out because, yeah, I did change from stream elements because stream elements hasn't been uh, working for me for quite some time. Right, B drill. Right, level 53 for Dragon Zord. Get in. And level 53 for T1000. Close combat. Let's see here. The user fights the foe in close uh, in close without guarding itself. It also costs the user's defense and special defense. Nah, no, nah, I think we're good. I don't like the fact that it lowers the defense. Swallow is next. Oh, we caught one of these. And speaking of... Let's go into T-1000. Should have taken down handy with the old uh, cycle cut. Yeah, because we already have good fighting moves with uh, Jaden. With the blaze again. I'll go spark yourself. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna battle this trainer first. Yo. Well, I'm surprised you've come this far, but you'll have to turn back. There isn't any chance that you could ever beat me. You say I don't know. You say I don't know. Infernape. Well, at least not a fucking Rayquaza, anyway. Give her that. Infernape with Drizzle. God, that's such a bad one for a fire type. Poor son of a bitch. Oh, Jesus. Really taking out the competition here. Right, what's next? Shift tree. Oh, we should take care of that. Jaden, get in there. You have to kind of look at uh, Streamlabs again, where I go wrong, because I did add it as a bot. Did add Streamlabs as a bot now. Level 48. Jeez, we're getting up there now. Hmm. I don't know. Because I really want to get that working, though. Because, yeah, stream elements has been, like, not working for me for, like, the past few streams.
What makes your Pokemon so special? Uh, you see what I have. Well, that brings us back, right. So we gotta figure this out. Hmm. How do we go about this now? Hmm. I wonder do we have to hit the the one down here? You know which one I'm talking about here. Look. Do I have to hit this again? It's all about getting to this gym leader now. God, I hate gym leaders with these kind of puzzles. Why can't it be just straightforward? Well, hang on, maybe. Maybe I might have it. Because the next bit... No, it doesn't connect. You gotta get them in a certain pattern. So if I were to go down. Sorry, I had to step away for a second. Well, this is a very colorful gym. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, then it. Fuck. All right, there we go. Yeah, it all depends on, like, where we move these. Oh, this is going to be a pin to ass. Come on. I'm really tired I had it there. Fuck. See, you can't drop down there either. Jesus Christ. It'll take me a while to figure this fucking thing out. The moment I hit this though, look. Fuck off. I messed it up again. Where did I? Hang on. Well, it's back the way it was. Oh, I hate puzzles like this. I really do. You know, keep it like that for now. Well, we have to... Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I have to do something with the bottom ones here then. If I remember correctly. I think you have to hit that one. And then... It should. There we go. Now we're cooking. Right. Um... I'm gonna take the experience share off, give you back the razor claw. Right, there you go. And yeah, we'll give the experience share to Smokey. Even though it's like the Pokemon we're rarely gonna use. Like it's the uh, HM slave, so fuck it. Alright, challenger. It's not often, but some trainers manage to come and challenge me. 
Well, they've all been boring battles. I didn't break a sweat beating them. <sighs> I'm Valkner, the gym leader. They say I'm the top gym leader in Sinnoh, but... Anyway, I guess we better get this done. I hope you're the trainer who'll make me remember how fun it is to battle. Right, what's your real name? Tia. Alright, this could go either way. What have you got? A Zoomeril. Right, not a bad start. Thank God it's not a fairy type. In uh, Gen 6, it becomes a fairy type. But it is a bit of a unit. Rain Dance. That's one thing about Azuma, it is a bit of a unit. I get it, you guys are tough, but we can match your toughness. Dog's it's gonna tank this as well. I think. Oh! Jesus. Aqua Ring. Why, well, she's gonna use the uh, potion. Yeah. No biggie, no biggie. Level 46. I wonder what Isaiah is going to be like. Level 53 or something. Like, he'll be on par with us. Almost there. Almost there. Yeah, heal away, boy. It's only a very little you'll get. Alright, that's one down. That's one down. Rain continues to fall. Motherfucker got Giratina. Okay. Dragon versus Dragon. And wait for it. Boom! Who is the superior Dragon Zord now? The rain stopped. Oh, we got him. We got him. Jump Luff is next. We're staying in. Solid Palkia here. Level 50. This is his ace. This is his ace here. I bet you this is his ace, right? That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage! <laughs> yes, I do have that sound clip. Nidoran, oh my god. Are you serious? Your trump card? Bitch, your Giratina was your trump card. Well, no. Yeah, his ace was a uh, fucking jump love. And there you have it, folks. You've got me beat. Your desire and the noble way your Pokemon battled for you. I even felt thrilled during our match. That was a very good battle. Bitch, I swept you. Right, there we go. <laughs> yes, laugh away, lad. That was the most fun I've had in the battle since I don't know when. It's almost made me excited to know you and your team will keep battling to greater heights. This is your 8th gym badge. You've earned this. The beacon badge. Let me put that on the overlay. And there we go. The hidden move waterfall even when you're not in battle. We haven't got that yet. Waterfall happens to be key if you're going to the Pokemon League. Also, because you've collected all eight badges, any Pokemon at any level of now will be you without fail. I want you to take this too. TM57. I wonder what that is now. Morning Sun. Is it? No, I don't think it's that, is it? Let's have a look. Level oh, it is Morning Sun. The user restores its own HP. The amount of HP regained uh, varies with the weather. Oh. I thought Giratina was going to be much trouble for us. Alright, how do we... 
Oh, I'm an idiot. There we go. So that is that, folks. Next up is on our way to uh, the Pokemon League. Well, there's Victory Road. No sign of our rival. Well, let's heal up. Oh. Let's heal up and then we'll be um, en route. One thing I will do as well, I might get some max repels, because since we're going through Victory Road. What do you think, folks? Do you think we will finish this tonight? Or will we, uh, or will we fall to the Pokemon League? Um, just want to double check here. What am I like with, um, repels? 37 of them. Okay, we are good. We are good. And folks, I'll be right back because I need to use the toilet once again. That monster's going through me like a motherfucker. But I won't be long. Time to take a piss. Right, I'm back. Let's continue. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It must be the certain flavor I drink of Monster that just goes through me. Uh, the one I'm drinking now is this one. Does taste nice. Mix punch. Big risk, big reward. Now, I'm just uh, dreading Cynthia. That's what I'm dreading. Uh, Alright, one thing I want to do, actually. Jeez, we got a fair amount of cash. Look at that now. I want to sell that... We got a shell, but I might give that to someone. Where's that nugget? There it is. Now, you know what? I'm going to buy some more Ultra Balls just in case. If um, our next encounter is going to be legendary. Well, we've the Master Ball, but won't hurt to have more of them, in all fairness. Uh, we will get. Yeah, I guess that many will do. Now. Right, we'll get this off for now, the HM, I believe. Oh, you, Bellend. Hey, cat. What the? You went and got all eight gym badges of Sinnoh? Oh, you, that's wicked. I envy you. But don't think you've won. Because I'm going to be the toughest trainer ever. You watch me. Before I was dreaming, I just wanted to be like my dad. Now, things are different. I thought about what being a trainer involves. I thought about what Pokemon are. We're going to get tougher one step at a time. I'm not going to challenge you to a battle now. I hate to say it, but I know you're tougher than me. But not a whole lot tougher, just a little. Our difference is about a yard. Nah, not even an inch. What I'm trying to say is that I will catch up to you in no time. If you don't hurry to the Pokemon League, I'll leave you in my wake. Ah, piss off. Was that your friend? Seeing how you two got along made me happy somehow. It must be wonderful having a friend like that. Mm hmm <laughs> A person that you can share anything and everything with. A person you can compete with without fighting. Um, it made me feel sort of warm seeing you two. It may seem odd, but I'd like you to have this as my thanks. This isn't much, but... Waterfall. Now, question is, who are we going to give it to? It contains Waterfall. If you use it, you can get to the Pokemon League. Um, I don't know how I should say this, but good luck. Thank you, Jasmine. Right, Waterfall, who are we going to give that to? Well, Barry, I think only, what, two Pokemon can learn it? That being Poseidon and Palkia. All 
Let me see here. Only Poseidon can. Surprisingly, uh, Palkia can't. Right. Um... I mean... Waterfall. To use the charges to fall at an awesome speed, it can also be used to climb waterfalls. I mean, might as well get rid of Mud Bomb. You know, we have Earthquake, so that's like the most powerful ground move. So, there we go. Yeah, I thought, Pos uh, like, um, not Poseidon, uh, Dragonzord could learn it. Route 223. Oh, this is a new encounter. But first, battle. I'm determined to go to the Pokemon League, no matter how hard it is. Right or Mia? Krogunk. Level 45. Battle our way through this route. This, this is so hard. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, our encounter is, let's see. Hypno. All right. I think we can catch this easily. Psych up. Level 36. Right, what are we going to nickname Hypno? I remember we named it Morpheus in our... What was it? Our Soul Silver Nuzlocke? I don't know. I was kind of stumped with a nickname, so I just call it that. I just took it off, um... What was it? Pokemon Name Raider? Yeah, we should be able to just catch this without hurting it. Well, then again, I just could go into thing T1000 with the false swipe. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Poison gas. Uh, where are you? T1000. Call it Quagmire? Oh, I get you. Well, I would give that to a Quagsire. That'll be a nickname I would give to Quagsire. Or, well, no. Quag uh, Quagsire, I would give, um, the nickname I would give that would be Glenn. You know, being, you know, Glenn Quagmire. <laughs> yeah, we can call it Quagmire. A Harba Herbert. Yo, know, like in um in Family Guy as well. <laughs> Knew I was gonna use poison gas on T one thousand. Meditate. They should have just called that move Taco Bell. <laughs> oh, poison gas. <laughs> Yeah, we don't have a Taco Bell here in Ireland, sadly. Alright, there we go. Alright, so we got Quagmire for one. I was gonna say Herbert. Yo, Herbert the Pervert. From uh, Family Guy as well. Seeing its swinging pendulum can induce sleep in three seconds. Even in, even in someone who just woke up. Either way, it needs a very dodgy nickname. Yeah, I'm gonna call it Herbert. There we go, Herbert. <laughs> hmm. I haven't seen the muscular on paper, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was awful. <laughs> well, 
you? Oh, you're starting to piss me off, you pigless son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that episode. That was the first episode with him, I think. That's so strange, but I'm sure you have had it. No. No, we don't have Taco Bell. <laughs> yeah, that was my impression. It's been a while since I've done Family Guy impressions. Oh man, we got a Dragonite! Level 46 as well! Ah oh, man. That's typical. If we catch one Pokemon, that's like... <laughs> that's like, um, yo, not great. And then it comes up with this. Sons of bitches. Dragonite would have been fucking lit. Yeah, rub it in my face, why don't you? Hi there, Chris. <laughs> I can't do it. Ah, oh, no. Uh, this fucker again. Level 46 this time. Get your fat ass back here. <laughs> God, he is a hilarious character, though. I like that he's Obi-Wan in the, uh, you know, that Star Wars series he did. I train at a Pokemon gym, too. Don't think you're getting to win, going to win easy. I like how he's Obi-Wan, and then, like, when he's fighting Darth Vader, like, his, um, lightsaber's all floppy. And then when he sees Chris, who's Luke Skywalker, it just comes up. <laughs> uh, the Bulbasaur. Oh, we'll kill it. Yeah, that Family Guy Star Wars, that was actually a good little, um, kind of spin-off they did. Yeah, his legs never goes limp. And then when he sees, Crim uh, sees Chris then... <laughs> but do. Yeah, yeah, we can take care of that. We mimic his voice at work all the time over the headsets. <laughs> that sounds like a fun workplace now. With your co-workers. Lunatone. Oh, it's... Remember Lunatone from um, earlier streams? It's come back to haunt us. It, that was one of the victims to Rayquaza. Yeah. Really at that moment, I thought we were going to get a game over. You know and I was nearly going to break the rule as well of restarting the save and just go at it again. I was nearly going to break that rule, but I said, look, we'll uh, try it and see. Robot Chicken has a pretty good uh, Star Wars series too. Yeah, the um, Robot Chicken Star Wars skits are fucking hilarious. My favorite one is probably when Palpatine gets a call from Darth Vader saying that the, uh, the Death Star is destroyed. Swim every sea there is. That's my dream. Deep breathing before battle. Breathe in and out. Yeah, that's probably my favorite one where Palpatine gets a call from Darth Vader saying that the Death Star blew up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down there. What? What do you mean they blew up the Death Star? <laughs> Absolutely low robot chicken. Yeah. Oh, Sean. They're all coming back to haunt us. Yeah, fucking Sean. Sean the Rapidash. And we got Mewtwo as well. Watch, all the way to the Pokemon League, our previous uh, members are going to come back to haunt us. Future Sight. Right, Shadow Punch. Where that didn't kill it. Alright, what's next? Jesus, with these legendaries! Zapdos! Alright, we will use Shadow Punch once again. Oh, good old Zapdos, or we nicknamed this uh, Electro. Because the head of uh, Zapdos reminds me of the mask of Electro from Spider-Man. Yeah, I think that's a cool nickname. Electro. I swear to God, if another legendary is going to come out. 
Level 54 for a Shmoke. Pluck. Yeah, we're really on the road to uh, the Pokemon League. All these got fucking legendaries. That's a fucking mythical. Jesus. Mythicals and legendaries, folks. Jesus. Get your... Get your asthmatic cash back here. <laughs> now... Oh, oh, sorry. Now get your uh, asthmatic gas back here. Uh, or I'll tell you what a whiny bitch you are about Padme or Panda Bear, whatever her name was. Oh, jeez, he's crying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember that now. It took me, oh, I don't know, it took me a second to figure out what you're referencing. Yeah, the robot chicken skit. Oh, just build another one? Well, who's gonna pay for it? You? You have an ATM in that torso light bright? Yeah, that'll be my favorite one now. What was the other one where he's going up the escalator and like the stormtroopers are like uh, going past him? It's like, Stormtrooper? My lord, Stormtrooper? And then like after a while he just goes, Go fuck yourself! <laughs> it's like legendary is going on here, yeah. Right, I'm gonna have to hang on. I don't wanna lose someone here now. Come on. Get rid of the Lapras. Oh no. Don't you dare. Acid armor. Fuck nice beam. Oh god. No 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 no. Oh my sweet oh no. Well, fuck, Dragon Zord's gone. Fuck. Are you serious right now? Motherfucker. Are you fucking kidding me? If it wasn't for that fucking sand stream. Dragon Zord. Bollocks. Kill this fucking thing. Like, I knew it was going to survive the ice beam. But then, yeah, sand stream killed it. Fuckers. We won't panic because I do have a backup. I do have a backup. Right, what's next? Togetic. Oh, sweet divine Christ. Ah, oh, that's bullshit. 12 deaths in. Sadly, we're going to have to put that to rest. Not done with my dream. I need to breathe in and breathe out because I'm fucking fuming here. Dragon sword. Right, we're going to have to fly back. Oh, that's a piss sake. But like I said, we have a backup. We do have a backup. Just sad, yeah. Oh my god. We do have a backup. It's not gonna be Kyogre or uh, Torterra. We're gonna have to bring in the big gun. Yeah. No, that is a, a deep one now. We won't, uh, we won't, we won't fret though, we won't fret. Because like I said, I do have a backup. Dent number 12. So, we're not going to do Mewtwo because he's got True Bond. 
Cerberus? Oh, we caught him uh, right after we caught uh, Giratina. Go with Torterra? No, Torterra is too low leveled. Hades. That's who I'm thinking we're going with. So, Hades, welcome along. Yes, we're going with Hades for this one. Like I said, bring out the big gun. And I'm going to give him the thing. Experience share. Or give you the razor claw. And we'll give you an experience share just so we can boost it up. That's such bullshit. We lost fucking Dragon Sword. Guess you can evolve Weedle. Oh, Weevil? Oh, the uh, Carapy? We could. We could, but I think we're going to stick to our guns here. We're going to have Giratina. Because what are the chances of um, of it like evolving to something? Yo, shit. Uh, right, we're going to put someone else in front. I'll put you in front. Yeah, we'll keep Jaden in front as well. Get on my way. Bonjamin, welcome. Well, motherfucker, why couldn't that be our encounter? Fucking ho oh. -ho. No, what did we get? Hypno. Yeah, and the Dragonite again. Yeah, showing us all these Pokemon we could have caught. Fuck's sake. Ah. Are right, ye two fuckers? All because of ye. Well, how are ya? It might not look like it, but I'm traveling now. Well, good to know. Right, what have you got? Menke. Spanky the Menke. There we go. Right, I'm gonna give something else to Poseidon. Hang on now, we will give you something else. Since you mostly got water moves. Yeah, give you the Mystic Water. Is that the Earth Plate? Boost up the water moves. Because he's mostly got water moves now, since we gave him Waterfall. I right, can get that item there, if we can. Where are you from? I am from Ireland. Hypno once again. To think we could have got Ho-Oh. I would have used the Master Ball there, in all fairness, if it was Ho-Oh. Uh, go away, will you? Can't believe we lost Dragon Zord. Right, how do we go get this item? Oh, there we go. Probably not going to be worth it in the end. Level 50, Jesus. Unlucky about the Euros then. Meh. Right, what is this? Sp oh my God. Really? Splash? Fucking waste. Right, I'm gonna have to use a uh, repel here. Yeah, I'm gonna use a repel here so we can get through this nice and easy. Although. Motherfucker. Oh my god. That's some ability for a Dragonite. Water Absorb? 
Goblin, welcome. That's a good ability for uh, for a Dragonite. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use a repel here, folks. Twelve deaths in. Can't believe we lost Dragon Zord. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Um, repel. That's what I was looking for. Uh, let's see, max repel. There we go. Get through that gap. How are you, Goblin? Hope all is well. We are we are en route to the uh, the Pokemon League, and we uh, unfortunately had a sad loss not long ago. We lost one of our Pokemon, uh, which we call Dragon Zord. Your Pokemon doesn't seem to be uh, tiring at all from carrying you on its back. Let me see how strong it is. Well, Poseidon. Oh, well, Poseidon will kick your ass. Fucking Gyarados. Doing good just getting home. Awesome. Right, water type versus water type. Oh! Oh my god, are you serious? Ice Fang. Yeah, that wouldn't have boarded well if we uh, had uh, Hades in front. Which we call Giratina. Skarmory is next. Oh, motherfucking Steelbeak. That's why I nickname is Skarmory. Nickname is Steelbeak. Such an awesome Pokemon. I like Skarmory. Sadly, it's gonna go down. There we go. Now, right or win? Go north here. Oh, there's a trainer here. I've decided I'm off to the Pokemon League if I win. <laughs> Fat chance. You're going down. Right, two Pokemon, Entrepreneur Kim, Monferno. Easy peasy. Take dash. Should be good experience here. 654. Latios. Staying in. Because I don't think... don't think Giratina is quite ready yet. Lost her purge. Oh, shit. Come on, come on. You can survive it. Good lad. Special defense fell, though. Credit, credit, credit. Booyah! Not very effective, but we got him. Alright, lovely stuff. Nearly worried there. I thought Lost of Purge was going to do a lot more to us. I'm give you a hyper potion. Now. Alright, fought you. Hello, sailor. I came out here because I want to see the Pokemon League for myself. Okay then, good for you. Engineer Thomas, Haunter. Should be all right. I think. Yeah, we're quick, super effective. I love Haunter, Haunter is awesome. Not bad experience. Geodude is next. Oh my god. This is all Poseidon here. Kicking ass, taking names. 
That's why uh, Swampert's like one of my favorite starter Pokemon. Well, final evolution. Next is Spearow. We're switching out. Y'all know who's coming out here. Here we go. Alright. <laughs> That's his cry instead of Raichu's cry. Alright. <laughs> Kill that bard. Bard! I'm shocked. Not really. I am. Yeah, I shocked you, alright. Shocked your bard. What's over this side here? Crash. <laughs> There's a knight in there. Oh, I want to go back and get that. This is all the same route, right? Didn't change. Power weight. Wait, what does that do? Let's see, power weight. Oh, oh, we must have uh, one already. Power weight, where are you? Uh, there we go. Yeah, we got three of them. A Pokemon hold item that promotes a HP gain on leveling but reduces speed stat. Eh. Right, onward. I'm gonna put on another repel. Got 36 of them, so we're all good when we get through Victory Road. My favorite kind of guy is someone that looks good out in the open sea. Good for you. Right or Mia, we already fought you. Barn me. Alright, it's not a good match up here. So I'm switching out. Jaden. I haven't dropped left in this. <laughs> Protect. Protect this. Oh, what the fuck? <clears throat> Tackle? Tackle my bollocks. Get fucked. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to get uh, Hades up to uh, up to a few levels here. Actually, let's see what his move set is. Can we actually change anything? Ominous Wind, Dragon Claw, Shadow Force, and Ancient Power. Hmm. Oh, leftovers. We've Shell Bell and leftovers. They're going to come in handy once we get to um, the Pokemon League. I'm being petty, but they could have put everything in your bag in alphabetical order. Yeah, they could have. Writer Florentino. Mantine. You should be able to take care of this. Crab hammer. Down you go. Tentacool. Oh, we could take care of this. It's all Poseidon here. Still can't believe we lost fucking... Dragon Zord. Yeah, I think in the later games uh, they do that. Put stuff in the bag, you know, with uh, alphabetical order. 
think there's a scent you can do that. Right, boss, come here. Yes, I know I can surf, but I'd rather swim instead. It does seem weird, I agree. No. Whoever floats your boat. Phoebus. You can take that down easily. Oh my god. Sp <laughs> Splash. Oh, you're just like Magic Carp. No. Kaploosh. <laughs> Daniel Pezzi, welcome. Yeah, how close is Giratina getting up to a level? It's a fair bit to go. Hmm. Oh. We're at the Pokemon League. Oh, this could count as an encounter here. Because I think... This is going into the Victory Road, right? Yeah, Victory Road. Yeah, so this could count as an encounter if we want. This is the Pokemon Center here. Yeah, so we can have an encounter in... Here? And also in Victory Road. Just want to run out this rappel first. Right, we're off. Right, our encounter in the Pokemon League is... Lord of shite. Catch it anyway. Right, what are we going to nickname this? Wait, hang on. I'm just thinking here. How does Apom evolve in this? A palm evolution. How does it evolve to Ambi Palm? When it levels up while knowing the move double hit. Okay. Ninja got cancer, Bob. Yeah, I I seen that. I was reading that, no. It is now. Cancer is yeah. Well it's got double hit, so. Next time we, if we ever level it up, yeah, it could evolve. But I don't know, I think we're at the point now where we're good. Come on. We can catch this little fucking thing. Yeah, uh, I say it's definitely not pretty, having it. I mean, hired an uncle who passed away from cancer. It's no joke. Come on, can we catch this little monkey? What are we going to nickname this if we catch it? I mean, like, not really the arse, but fuck it. There we go. We caught the monkey. Damn, that sucks for you. Imagine... Yeah, I know. Lives high among the treetops. It can use its tail as freely and cleverly as its hand. Right, what are we going to nickname this? Uh, fuck, I'm just going to call it Monkey. Monkey. Yeah, I'm just going to call it Monkey. Rick, oh, 
Mikey, welcome. Rick James. <laughs> no, it's a female. It's a female monkey. Yeah, we're past that point now. I think we're getting to like the last of the um, encounters. So what are we going to get in? Yeah, I've been down the road, unfortunately. Definitely throws you for a loop. <laughs> Rick James. Right. Victory Road. Let's see what we're going to catch here. And then we're going to use the repel. Stumpy. I mean, he has one. No, he's got he's got two legs. So the tail is like, you know, has a kind of a hand on it as well. Right. Our encounter here is. Lord of shite. Yeah, fucker. Should I bother? It's got hydro pump though. Oh, you son of a bitch. That's just laughing right into my fucking face here. Poison jab. <sighs> Fuck off. Just getting the ball tentacle. Poison jab, water pulse, hydro pump. It's got good moves, but it's a tentacle. Like, is there any point attacking this thing? Just chuck the uh, ultra balls at it. Ah, uh, that is such a pain in the ass. There we go. It can evolve. I will say that it, it, it can evolve. The jellyfish Pokemon. Because this body is almost entirely composed of water, it shrivels up if it is washed ashore. I'm just going to call this thing Squidward. I don't care about gender anymore. I'm just going to call it Squidward. Fuck it. So much for our fucking last encounter in the game, folks. Right, we will put Repel on, battle these trainers. I keep battling so I can soar even higher into the skies. Right or Bob? Yanma. Oh, feck off. Right, I'm going to switch out here. Jaden. Ancient power. Oh, it's going to sting. Okay. Thought I was going to do a lot more. Take that. Arcanine is next. Oh. Fuck, we're going to have to use a thing on Poseidon. Look at Arcanine, though. Such a badass Pokemon. Status healers. We got plenty of full heals, so might as well. Yeah. 
Yeah, we ate that. There you go. Oh, that was speed. Jesus. Well, kind of not surprising. Does definitely has like the higher speed set than a uh, Swampert. Well, there we go. Level forty eight for Hades. Yeah, we're gonna keep the experience share on uh, on Hades. Oh, I'm. Another Luster Sword. Oh my god. No, stop reminding me of fucking Dragon Sword. Fuck. That's the way out. What was that thing here? Um, Hang on till I... That's the second Luster Sword. I kept it on... Uh, on Palkia. When he put him in the RIP box. <laughs> I'm gonna use the rock climb here. Right, Smokey. I am a psychic. I can see your future. I can see the future! <laughs> Sorry, I was just thinking of uh, Dragon Ball Z a bridge. Bioplume. Oh, it's not a bad matchup for Poseidon. I think. So. Jaden. Fuck, you had to use that, didn't you? Yeah, Mega Drain all you want, shit's not gonna do shit. Don't be doing this, Jaden, come on. We're not gonna lose another one. Jaden! Hate when this fucking happens. What the f. Will you stop, Jaden, for fuck's sake? Get your bitch ass together. Fuck me. That's just, that's fucking a piss egg right there. Yeah, I'm just gonna use a full heal. Such bullshit. That, what, four times in a row? So stupid, man. No, you should have speed a feckin' Vileplume now. Come on, Jaden. There you go, lass. There you go. And it's dead. Oh, seven people watching. Awesome. Right, next up is Lunatone. We should be able to take care of that, I think. Or, better yet. No, 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 no. W w bad, bad. Just realized, yeah, Psychic type. I was looking at the Rock type part of it. Embargo. Kind of. Oh, who gives a shit about that? Fuck off. No. Level 54 for Poseidon. Regigigas, oh Jesus. Jane, get in here again. This is going to be a doozy. Or 
Or a sphere. Knock it out. Knock it out. Come on. Yes! Get in, you son of a bitch. So be it. I will not divulge what I know of your future. Avalanche? Oh, we already have that. Wonder who could learn that now. We got two of them TMs. Right, so we back up. Yeah, I forget. What is this um, Victory Road like in, in comparison to like the other games? Don't think it's as bad, is it? As previous games? Yeah, we use just use the max repel. We get through this fairly lively here. Oh, there is a number of uh, steps we can go through. What have we got up here? Yeah, it's a bit of a maze here. Show me uh, how you've battled to get here. Let's do this. Very well. She asked for it. Loomis. Right, we can take this on. Crab hammer. And you should go down right away. Pincer is next. Um, geez, well, be good. Not T1000. Guess Jaden again. I mean, Smokey could do it because he's got fly, but. Eh. Where I use fire. God, when you look at Pincer, you see how really horrifying it looks, right? It is a scary looking Pokemon. Ammonite is next. Stay in. Oh, good old Lord Helix. Remember that in uh, one of the earlier streams of this? Yeah, went down to a Groudon. This is like I said, they're all coming back to haunt us. Oh, what could have been? Yep, that's how I battle love. An Everstone, load of shite. Yeah, I remember this now. This area can be a bit of a maze. Oh, I remember, don't you have to use the bike here as well? To go up them uh, little ramps? Look at the owl lad there. Oh, we got trainers here too. Hang, I'm gonna heal up someone. So what do you think? Should we do the Pokemon League in this stream or save it for next? Well, I mean, like, we're you're not the end game, folks, so might as well do it on stream tonight. You, one look at you tells me you're a real contender. Ella kid. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Earthquake. Oh! Kaboo tops. It's not like that's gonna save you. Yeah, didn't save your own bit. A lovely experience, though. Armaldo. Staying in, Jesus. Just do Earthquake all the way through. Only three hours in, so you have time to, yeah. 
That's how long um, it would take me to get through this uh, victory road. Slash. Oh, that was a crit. Get some good experience though, look. Nearly a thousand there. Well, Elikids aren't really going to give us much. Now screech all you want. Ain't going to save you. From this earthquake. And down you go. That was all Poseidon there. Absolute fucking monster. Now. What do we have up here? Oh, that just brings us back. Fucking messed this up, didn't I? Well, maybe not. We got plenty of max repels, so we should get through it fairly easy. I'm gonna peel up again just to make sure. Because each of these battles are like gonna be up to like level 50 Pokemon now. This total stranger will be a good way to see if I have what it takes to own the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Will it now? We will see. Schoolboy Robin. That's so hilarious. The other trainer had Omanyte. And now, look, almost there. Lord Helix himself. Oh, fucking protect. I hate when, like, that just prolongs the battle. There. This should be super effective. And there we go. Next up is Porygon Z. Yep, Jaden, you can take it. You got this. Close to leveling up as well. Yeah, level 48. And that should be it. Down you go. Boom. Jeez, this rate, I'd say we'd probably get to Hades up to level 50-ish. Right, level 54. Level 49 for Hades. As soon as I said that. That ball just now makes you tougher than everyone in the world. Oh, funny Dragon Sword was here. Oh, you're a trainer. Let me see how well your Pokemon can battle. Very well. Have at ya. Nuzleaf. Yeah, this is going to be dangerous for... Poseidon. Bring out. Alright. <laughs> Every time. Torment. Alright. Single beam. Should take it down, right? Means dark grass. Booyah. Right, next up, Bastiodon. Uh, Jaden. The big bastard itself. Seven people still watching, cool. Yeah, I hope everyone's doing good today. Let's we'll see if we can uh, beat this Nuzlocke tonight. Gentlemen, Jonathan. Brilliant. That it was. Oh, what's down there? Good thing we got all these repels.
Yeah, I'm not gonna waste, like, you know, encounters in that. I'm just gonna plow the way through. Well, it just brings us here. Which I'm not sure if this is the right way to go. My Pokemon knows karate. I'm warning you. It's a tough one. Karate. Dane Cook of martial arts. <laughs> Who remembers that from Archer? Cloister. Maybe I should put someone else in front. Bring out. Alright. Yeah, that's his cry now instead of Raichu's cry. Spikes. Bit, uh, bit late for that. You're just prolonging the inevitable, lad. I'm sorry, it's never gonna get old, is it? <laughs> Jeez, Hades is getting all that experience. Right, bet uh, Ryu from Street Fighter. <laughs> I know who Dane Cook is, but I'm not sure about that movie, though. I absolutely love it. It makes me laugh every time. Oh, rash. Well, Archer. Archer is um, it was a TV series. I'm a psychic. I can see your past. You won't want to see my past, lad. Entrepreneur Noel. Loud red. Right, Poseidon, you should be able to take this down. Pucciana's next. Um, yeah, right. All right. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's like in the span of five minutes, we've used that sound so many times. You think you should go down to single beam, right? Yeah, dark type is weak to bug type. Jigglypuff, and we're staying in. Rat should be able to take this down. Oh, you said Archer. Uh oh, I know Archer. It was actually one of my favorite shows in the mid 2010s. Yeah, I watched a couple of episodes of it. It is funny. Your past. You've been through a lot. I know I have. Well, I can't get that. <clears throat> oh, we can use Waterfall here. Hope to God the Nuzlocke actually, or the Randomizer, will, um, will be good to me with the Elite Four. Water pulse. Alright, alright, not bad. Wasn't that what um, Dragon Zord had? When we uh, caught it? Right, you got yourself here. We're gonna battle every trainer we can. I think Pokemon that are tough to begin with and tough them up even more. You can help me. I'll help you. Help you lose. Look at this guy. Beautifully. We can take that down. No biggie at all. Again, I should put someone else in front. So, so they can get uh, an odd level up to level 54. Good experience though. 775. <coughs> bit doof. Ah, bit doof. Right, T1000. We haven't had you in, out in a while. Ladies and gentlemen, 
I give you... Kevin Dunn. <laughs> you might like... Oh, I, I mean, I did try to watch it. Couldn't get into it. I know of it, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to put someone else in front. <laughs> Kevin Dunn. Oh, if we call a uh, fucking Bidoof, that's exactly what we'd nickname it. That's because Yuji Outlaw said it to me. It's not for everyone, yeah. Where the hell are we? A repel effect wore off. Yeah, this is a bit of a maze, isn't it? I'm gonna go back, because this looks like the way we need to go. Yeah, I just want to see what's over this side here. I mean, we'll get through this, like, pretty quickly with all the max repels I have. Oh, see, look at all the trainers here. A flame orb. Oh, what's up here first? And we'll get to them trainers. Oh, trainer here. Red scarf. I got in your way. Victory roll. Somehow it feels as if my journey is now coming to an end. But before the final chapter is written, I must pen your defeat. If you say so. Schoolboy Jill. What have you got? Alright. We can, we can take care of that. No biggie at all. Boom. This should be good experience. 709. Next is Spinarak. Um, go right. All right. <laughs> That's replacing the cry. It's replacing Raichu's cry. Oh, Jesus. It's got hail. Snow warning. Oh, that's what it's called. Yeah, same thing. And wait for us, it's gone. That wasn't how I planned the final chapter. Well, you're not going to finish your story. You ain't Cody Rhodes. Oh, hold on. Can we get anything there? Oh, fucking Barry. How he is. Oh, it's a double battle. It's the double teams of aces. We're gonna overwhelm you. We form a combination that's in perfect sync. How do you expect to counter that? Well, I'll show you. May and Emma. Braun says. Butterfree and Jump Bluff. You'll definitely take one out easily. Psych cut you and blaze kick yourself. Um, oh jeez, you turn. Uh, Korea Godzilla, welcome. Um, if you see the uh the bottom right corner where the cubone skull is, we got twelve deaths. It's on the overlay right there. Come on, go down. We'll just finish it with a slash. Fucking new turn. Can't do anything because it can't switch out.
Hang on now, what's going on here? Sorry. Jeez, we got a fair amount of dough there. Fucking 12 grand. Oh, nothing there. Right, up we go. Oh, item. Schmoke ball. Oh, that's to help escape. Yeah, so we got 12 deaths. We had one recently. Sadly, Dragonzord went down. Or, uh, Palkia. Which I thought I was going to survive, like, the, uh, the Ice Beam. I knew well it was, because it's not really effective against it. But then it's like the Sand Stream came in and took it down. Which was from, uh, Rapidash. Yeah, it was in the double battle. Right, on we go. We'll go to where we need to really go. I think we're going the right way anyway. It's like, don't you have to traverse upward? Yeah, we go this way. Right, up we go. Now. Yeah, I think we're good. I can sense that your Pokemon have a lot of trust in you. You and your Pokemon, see, you seem to be a glow. Three Pokemon. Gentleman Mark. Rest of the Jared Lee shot. Come on, crit this motherfucker. Boom! <laughs> From. <laughs> Alright! <laughs> From Radicate to Rattata. Oh, that is fucking funny. Jared Leisho Jr. <laughs> Rest. <gasps> Level 50 for Hades. Must have learned heal block, eh? Magby is next. We're staying in. I want to get, like... At least my Pokemon up to level 54. Yeah, we're not going to get much out of this anyway. <laughs> that was hilarious. I was going to say, probably this uh, trainer likes rat Pokemon. I would laugh if his last one was like, yo, Pikachu or rat, or not rat uh, Raichu. I don't understand it now. I understand you like rats. A magnet. That would be good for um for rat. In all fairness though. Oh, I see where we have to go, okay. I think we're getting there. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, is that the way out? Look at the cave there. This is a place where tough trainers naturally con congregate. It's ideal for training. Yeah, ideal for whooping your asses. Entrepreneur Donna. Oh, that's... That's something. It's a fucking spare tomb. Yeah, that's dangerous for a T-1000. Because really, before Gen 6, this didn't have a weakness. Sucker punch. Oh, Jesus, that did a fair amount. Fuck. I'm going to heal up just in case. Fucking hell. Don't you dare do that again.
Mento. Wait, that's gonna... Yeah. Yeah, feckin' Aegis. Next up is Drafrig. Fucking might as well stay in. We should be alright. Single beam. There we go. Zen Heber, oh fuck. This could sting. Oh, oh. Oh, flame body. Yes, it comes into play. You fucked up. You fucked up. <laughs> Next up is why not? Oh fuck. The Nozlock Killer itself. Well, Nozlock Killer Jr. The other one being uh Wabafet. Come on, kill this little demon. Who? That's why I like it here. I get to battle tough characters like you. Man, let's heal up. Yeah, Rack got an awful baiting. Wait, that's out. That's going out. Hold on. Okay. But I kind of want to um, battle the rest of the trainers here. Yeah, I think that's the way out. Oh shit. We could do this. Oh yeah, I want to battle the remaining trainers that are around here. Let me size you up. Aim for the Pokemon League, Dash. That's all you should be thinking about. Fuck another experience share. Should we give that to someone, I wonder? And there's another spot here we can rock climb up. Thought that was going to be a trainer there, that guy. Alright, what's up here? Oh! Aeroblast! Nice, I think we already have a TM of that. Yeah, folks, I think we are uh, done with Victory Road. I thought that was going to be a lot longer. Right, we'll use one more... Repel. Yeah, I was wondering if you could double uh, that up with different Pokemon. Yeah, you can. Um, it would kind of mean that like the Pokemon you'll have out in battle gets less experience, but the ones that are going to hold the experience share get more, I think. This is it. Shit, we could have got an encounter here for Pokemon League. <clears throat> this is it. We're here. First thing there was like all quiet. Is there an item here? No? Okay. Well, folks, here we are. Gonna get a lot of these. Fifty of them. Get some max potions. Gonna need everything we can. The moment of truth, folks. Hyper potions. We have twenty. Might as well get a few more. Yeah, 20 of them. 
Um, full heals. Yeah, there we go. We made it, folks. The question is, can we beat the Pokemon League with what we have? Oh yeah, I'm gonna sell items. Uh, let's see, splash, get rid of that. That'll give toxic to anyone. Recycle. Get rid of that. We don't need that. Okay. What are we gonna do first? We might get extremely lucky. Well, fingers crossed. What I'm gonna do first, we're gonna go over the um, the TMs here. Cause I wanna see, well, who's, who can learn this? Poseidon could apparently learn this. Psychic. But I think we're good with the moves that we have. Right, Gunk Shock, who can learn that? Y'all can, all right. N not really any bother. Psycho Shift. Blast burn. Who can learn this now? Apparently, Rack can. And yourself. Might get rid of Slash for that. Gyro Ball. Who can learn this? Hmm. Aeroblast. His mom and dad are dead. They are dancing with Biggie Smalls in hell. Whoa. Aeroblast. Oh, could get that to... Could get that to Giratina. What do we get rid of, though? Hmm. I don't know. Well, it's time to come in. Hey, Ujiala, welcome. How's your uh, PC doing? Dragon Breath. Solar Beam, Fury Cutter, Shadow Punch, Flash Cannon, Hydro Pump, Fire Fang. Yeah, we're trying to just go over like uh, some of the TMs here. Like before we head on to the uh, the Pokemon League. Jeez, you all could learn Hydro Pump. Fucking hell. What am I going to do? Still waiting to get it back. Uh, I think... Give Aeroblast to yourself. Question is, what do we get rid of? We can't get rid of Cut. Guess a lot of random trolls. Well, there was a troll in the chat. Hmm. I don't see it anyway. Fuck it. Um, fuck. I don't know. It's either Blast Burn or Aero Blast I would give to T1000. Where's Blast Burn? There it is. Because apparently you can learn that. What do you think? Trolls are commonplace. Well, yeah, that's true. The foe was raised by a fire explosion. The user must rest on the next... Nah. No, I'm not doing that one. It's a good move, but, like, I don't want to lose out in a turn. So, yeah, I'm going to give it Aero Blast. I've got two of the TMs. Not sure how that person got the YouTube name Bob. Oh, Bob is a troll? Yeah, get rid of False Wipe. There we go. Um, who can learn Dragon Breath? I know probably Giratina can learn it. Unable? What? It's a dragon type. Solar Beam, Fury Cutter, Shadow Punch. No, no, we didn't use Frieza. Frieza's in the PC. Yeah, we're not using Frieza because it has a shit ability called Truant, which it doesn't attack on consecutive turns. Uh... 
We did lose Dragon Zord. We lost Dragon Zord. Sadly. Hence why Hades is there. We have Hades, the Giratina. Yeah. Um trying to think what else. Well, let's go over the moveset of everyone first, right? I think we're good with him, with T1000. Jaden, I wouldn't mind replacing Slash with something. Poseidon we are good with, I think. For our Alright. I think we're good with. Um, the move I would like to actually replace will be Thunder Shock. That's the weakest move we have. Ursa Ring, well, that's our HM slave, so. Yeah. Right. And then we have um, Giratina. Ominous Wind. I don't know. I think the move set with Giratina is alright. Flash Cannon. Who can learn that now? Oh, Jaden could learn that. The user gathers, gathers all its light energy and releases it at once. It may also lower the full special defense stat. You know what? We're going to give that to Jaden. Everyone can learn it. Jesus. Or we could. No, oh, hold on. I mean, Aura Sphere actually, you know, is a bit better than Double Kick. Slash is, well, you know, it does have a good critical hit ratio and a 70 damage. Move a certain hit. You know, I'm going to get rid of Double Kick. Right, Flash Cannon is for Dash. Shadow Punch. Bone Rush. Wait, what are you like again, huh? Nah, not great. Seismic Toss, Grass Knot, Aero Blast again. Cycle Shift. I know what I could do. Hang on. Who can learn this? Giratina can, but I don't know. I was thinking maybe, you know, Toxic Spikes would be handy because it would, um, it would poison the, the opponent's Pokemon as he throws it out. What about Avalanche? Who can learn that? You can, apparently. I know I'm kind of delaying the inevitable here, but I want to make sure we have, um, good moveset going in. But yeah, I think it's time, folks. I think it's time. Question is, who did we bring out in front? Hmm. I don't know. Jesus. Um. I think I might get rid of Thunder Shock for this, maybe. Toxic Spikes is a must. Right. So if we do that, right, Giratina can only learn it. What do we get rid of? That is the question. Ominous Wind. User creates a gust of repulsive wind. It may also raise all the user's stats at once. I mean, that's pretty much the same thing here. Look, the user attacks with a prehistoric power. It may also raise all the user's stats at once. Like, they're... They're equal, so it's either them two. Dragon Claw will keep. Shadow Force will keep. I mean, two ghost moves? I I'm thinking, yeah, I think we get rid of Ominous Wind. Because having a rock type move is actually pretty good, in my opinion. So yeah, we'll do that. I'm thinking, should we give Blast Burn to a rat? Because he can learn it. Look. Get rid of Ominous Wind. Yeah, we just did. Yeah, so we got Blast Burn here. The foe was raised by a fire explosion. The user must rest on the next turn, however. 
You see, that that's the that's the downside of that move. I was thinking, should I get rid of Thunder Shock for that? Now we'll think about it as we go along. We'll think about it as we go along. But yeah, I think what well, I could do as well. Um, yourself. Yeah, I mean, I won't mind getting rid of Defog for something. But Giratina first with Toxic Orbs. Well, here's the thing though. Like, I don't know what the, um, we don't know what the Pokemon is to start with. And we don't know what level it's going to be at. But, fuck it, we'll do that. Yeah, I suppose. I'm just thinking with the move deleter. Where's the move deleter in this game? I want to delete Defog and give it something else. You know? Just at least have Swokey, you know, get in a bit of action, you know? Uh, move the leader. Move the leader and Platinum, where are you? Um, Canlave City, right. We're just gonna... Hey, hang on. Can we fly back here? It's a safe strategy. Wait, can we actually fly back here if we get out? Room for a level 100 Kevin done. No, I'm just kind of thinking actually, no. If we, um, if we back out, if we fly out, do we have to go through Victory Road again? Right, let's... Just trying to make sure I'm preparing myself for this, folks. Also, do you have Spikes or Stealth Rock? No. We have Toxic Spikes, that's it. Right, let's go over what we have. I mean, fuck, I think we're good. I think we are good, right. Oh, god damn it, not you. Hold it, don't go off without me. You're challenging the Pokemon League, aren't you? That's why I'm here too. Let's see who's more worthy of making the challenge with a battle. Obviously, this Bellend has to show up. Gobshite. Or shall I say... Hold on, let me get the sound effect here. <laughs> and oh fuck. Flamethrower, ah, we could eat that. Test strategy on Bellend, oh fuck, he's got burned. Where the fuck did he get a Charmeleon? Take the hint of feck off already. Uh, no, right? Exactly. Fucking burn. Onyx is next. No, I won't use it yet. Um, I mean, fuck. We should be able to take down uh, this easily. He's got six Pokemon on him. Jesus. Crap hammer. My next up, Lucario. I think I know what we'll go to. T1000, get in there. You're about to level up as well. Let's try out your new move. Lugia's um, signature move. Oh bollocks! Oh no 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 no! We're not we're not doing this shit. Kill it! Oh! Thank God. Funny, I thought that would be super effective against Lucario. Or oh, maybe it's the Steel type. Aron is next. Alright, Aron. Uh, we will go to... Go to Jaden. Look at him. Alright, Aura Sphere. Look 
at Aaron, though. Look at his wee eye. And Polion is next. Alright. Hang on, hang on. Alright. Do you know one thing I'm realizing as well? It hit 12 a.m. here, so in each of the, the uh, cities, there's, um, what you call it? Battles. We can do that. Get everyone up to um, a higher level. You know the daily battles in um, the Pokemon centers? Yeah, they'll be all refreshed. Oh, fuck. Brian? Okay. Yeah, and they'll be all at these levels as well. So what do you think? I think we should go about doing them. Aaron looks like my puppy when he wants food. <laughs> now. Yeah, what do you think? I think that'll be a good way to get more um, more levels up. Just to be safe. Level 51 here. Oh, critical hit. Get fucked. Chief Bellend. What just went down? My team still needs raising. Damn right. I guess I'm not ready for the Pokemon League if I'm losing to you. Darn it, you watch though. I'll get tougher and win my way through the Pokemon League because I'm going to become the champion, the toughest trainer. Cat, you better not lose to anyone before me. We'll see. Yeah, I think that'll be um, a good idea. I'm just want to double check here. If I use fly, would I be able to just fly back to um, to here or the the Pokemon Center before the Watchcash Victory Road? Because I do want to like battle them, yo, know, daily trainers. Just want to double check here. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to battle them daily trainers and we'll, uh, yes, you can. Oh, lovely stuff. Yeah, what do you think? I think that would be a good idea just to get another few odd levels up. Right, there's no trainer here. Yeah, they tend to mix and match around like where they're at. They um, switch around Pokemon centers. Right, Jubilife. I think also as well, the Pokemon Mansion. We can uh, do the um, the five main knockout. Yeah, we got these two. Right, I'm gonna switch around here. I forget what they fucking have though. And we'll see anyway. Oh, I remember, I think she has Empoleon. And the other one she has is Typhlosion. So this is actually good experience here. Don't know how you, uh... Oh, flame body. There you go. Don't know how she feckin' us bad me. Go on the rash. See, look at their levels, you know? Right, level 54 for the rash. And we'll get Hades up to another level as well. Right, next is Typhlosion. Yeah, we'll just do the Pokemon Center ones and then we'll get back to um, going to the Pokemon League. Yeah, might as well. This is hit like 12 a.m. Like they have reset it. It's got a, you know, big brain idea. Media is the victim. Yeah, I forget what this bollocks has as well. Uh, you know what, you're about to level up, Sidon, so I'm going to put you in front.
Try Mako, okay. Waterfall this bitch. Going, going, going. Gone. Out of here. Level 51 for Hades. Dog trio. Ah, perfect. Slash, slash me bollocks. And down she goes. Yeah, I think this is a good idea. I know, like, I'm prolonging the stream here doing this, but... You know, better safe than sorry, you know? Regigigas is next. Okay. Jaden, get in there. Take down this fucking titan. Aura Sphere. Get knocked the fuck out. Slowly but surely. Boom. I mean, look at all this experience we're getting as well. Swablu's next. Uh. Alright. Alright. Oh, Lord, I love it. Thunderbolt. Even though it's going to be giving me very little experience. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blame the camera, obviously. I'm not complaining. Kind of been lurking and taking care of bills and things until I get bored of doing them and jump back in. Yeah, no problem, Tall Grant. No problem. Barry, I'm going to go back to Canalave. And go to the move deleter. Wait, where, where, which place is he in again? By the water, is it here? Oh, it's him, is it? Oh yeah, there he is, moved the layer. Found him nice and quick. At least with, um... With the moved layer, you can actually delete the HM moves. So yeah, we'll get rid of Defog. Don't need it anymore. Now, the question is, what can Smokey learn? What can he learn now? Let's just see here. Avalanche? You can't, okay. Firefang. See if you can learn that. No. Hydro Pump, hardly. Oh, he can. Everyone can, apparently. Shadow Punch, I already have that on someone. Solar Beam. Rolling Kick. Wait, what's that like? Fuck. Sixty, yeah. Thrash. That might not be bad for him. Power Whip. Unable. I think trash might be good. That's too weak. Seismic toss. Wait, what's the thing in that? Should be able to learn this, right? No, he shouldn't. Oh fuck. Water pulse, aeroblast, dryer ball. Well, we can learn that. The user tackles the foe with a high speed spin. The slower the user, the greater the damage. That might not be bad. 
We'll give it to him. Because he's not like, you know, the fastest, you know? Hardly could learn Psychic. No. Only Poseidon can, apparently. Funny, you think Gallade could be able to learn it. Speaking of, I'm gonna switch around here. And we will fly to the next city. Right, see if there's anyone in Orber Pokemon Center. Anyone here? Oh, there is. Lovely. Gracie Idol. She's going down. Swin up. Yeah, Jane could take care of this. Some people still watching, cool. Yo, we'll do all these um, Pokemon Center uh, trainers and then we'll get to the Pokemon League. Celio's next. Ah, oh, we can take care of Celio. Definitely go down to an Aura Sphere. Knock the fuck out. Lovely stuff. Haunch crows next, right? We're switching. Bring out the right. Lovely stuff. Get that experience for Hades as well. Alright, switch. We'll go to T1000. Definitely could take out a Grimer. Psycho cut. And wait for it. It's going. It's good. Get that money as well. Now. Another one bites the dust. Alright, a few more to go. Wherever the next one is. Um, let's try Faroma. Anyone here? Oh, yeah. Little big joke. Yeah, we'll keep Jane in front. Forget what this little bastard has. It's obviously not a Pikachu. It's Magius. Okay, we should be able to take that down. Blaze kick. Total dials next, right? Bring in the rat. All right. <laughs> That's probably the most overused sound um, on this um, whole let's play. The rat. Make sure why not. Never gets old, though. N never gets old. Sandstorm Rages. Right. What's the last one he has? Magneton. Right, Jaden. You got this. Jaden Animations. Bye. 
That's who it's named after, by the way. <laughs> and it's her favorite Pokemon. I know I kind of said that already in like a previous stream or so. Yeah, I do like her uh, videos. Actually, her first ever video, I say like Manny, was her video on her Ruby Randomizer Nuzlocke. I think I, that video is like, what, like a little over 100 million views, I think. I think she did a video about her uh, Platinum Randomizer as well. Which was, um, yeah, it was pretty good too. Alright, uh, what's next? We'll go to, yeah, we'll go to Eternal City. Just go in and out of the Pokemon Center, uh, see if the trainer's there. Because again, they're not in like every Pokemon Center. They alternate between um, different ones each day. Try Snow Point. There's a trainer there. I'll just laugh if, like, the, um, the Elite Four is going to be a breeze, you know, get through it awful quick. Right, nothing there. Look at the lone Psyduck. There's a Psyduck that's there, just on his own. Alright, try Celestic Town. Oh, where we caught Dragon Zord. Good times, good times. Yeah, before we did the Pokemon League, we'll have a little remembrance of like who we lost over the um over the Nuzlocke. You know? We're at 12 deaths. Now can we keep it that way once we get to the Pokemon League? Or get through the Pokemon League or even up to Cynthia. My heart on I think there should be a trainer here. I think one of them is a dub battle. No, no one there. Yeah, again, they alternate between, like, different Pokemon centers each day. So, one city could have one uh, in one day and won't have it the next day, if you get me. So, we've two more. Well, I think the other city, Sunny Shore, should have one as well. If they're alternating between, like, all the Pokemon centers. No one there either. Jesus. It's like they're afraid of battling me. Shmoke, <laughs> um, fly. My flying bee. Right, anyone in here? Yep, this is the double battle. Right. We will push... Yourself and yourself here, I think. All right, who's close to leveling up? That is the next question. Mm, doesn't make a difference, I suppose. Yeah, double battle time. Corsola and Leafeon. I think we have uh, some good uh, choices here. Uh, quick attack all you want. I think. Oh, that did a little bit. Did a wee bit. Oh, come on. How does that not kill Leafeon? Come on. Really? Power gem. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I'll just finish him off. Jeez, power gem did a fair bit there with the uh, critical hit. Fuck. Caught her down. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh, no. 
Don't crit. Oh, thank God. Right, there we go. Geez, that was scary for a second there. Right, that's that. Let's heal up. Sorry, noses at me a bit. It is nippy. That reminds me, I have a train to catch tomorrow because I'm actually going down to see family tomorrow. One well, of my cousins, she's uh, coming home for uh, for a few days. So I'm going to go down to uh, visit them. Let's try Pastoria. I say someone's definitely there. Yeah, someone has to be here. Allergies? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, yeah, the clown. Yeah, I remember he starts off with Magnazone, so we're good for uh, Jaden in the front. You clown. Or a sphere. I'm assuming somewhere near Cork. No. Nope. Graveler's next. Ah, we can knock that out. Should have speed it anyway. There we go. K motherfucking O. Wormple is next. <laughs> Fucking Wormple. Burn. Burn them all. Oh, so close to getting the level up. Oh, we level up for Hades, so. though. Right, he's getting there in the levels. He's getting there. Level 52. So he's not that far off now. So yeah, I'm actually comfortable enough to get him in the front and throw the uh, toxic spikes out. It all depends on like what the Pokemon that uh, the first member of the Elite Four is going to have first, you know? It's always that, you know? It's always the first Pokemon you don't know. But then when you beat that Pokemon and it says what's coming up next, then you're, you're alright then. But look at the health and Giratina though, like over 200. I just want to see here if there's someone in the Pokemon Center. And then we'll, uh, for real, get to the Pokemon League. I think we've done enough, uh, done enough grinding. Oh, look. Yay. There's this guy. Do you want to hear me play my guitar or do we battle? We battle. I think he's only got one Pokemon though, I think. Yeah, it is. Shroomish. Alright, we can take care of that. Jaden. Kill it. Kill this Goomba. You mook. So close to leveling up. Come on. Horse shit. Right, off to the Pokemon League. Um. Oh, we can't. Oh, it's a green spot there. So that's to Victory Road. There we go. Okay. So this is legit, you know, going to the Pokemon League. We want to get Jane up to level 55, though. Hang on now. All we need is one battle. That's it. I know you're all probably like, come on already. Right, what is here? What is this? Perfect. Oh, we can knock that out. And this doesn't count as encounter because we already got the um, the encounter before the victory road. 
Porygon too. Easy though, because look, we just knock it out with Aura Sphere. Bob's your uncle. Experience. Now, we are ready to go, folks. God help us. I like how everything just went quiet there. Just top up uh, once again, and yeah. We'll have a wee remembrance of those we lost before we uh, go in. So let's see. Go to our PC. There we go. So here's all the Pokemon we've caught. Uh, two of them are in the uh, the daycare, that being Kyogre and Torterra. But here we are, folks. A little remembrance here. So, Lord Helix, uh, very beginning of uh, the Nuzlocke, uh, we caught one of them. Sadly went down to a Groudon, God rest ya. Spike, who sadly went down to an Entei, that was early on in Nuzlocke. It really, though, like, in the uh, early parts of the Nuzlocke, it was tough on us. We got a lot of deaths. Due to people having, like, loads of, um, legendaries. Mothra. Remember you went down to... What was it? A Jinx we were trying to catch in Twin Leaf Town. Scrotum the Rotom. Sadly went down to, uh, a Swamp Bird, of all things, uh, with Bide. I remember... I remember thinking that, like, oh, Bide won't affect it because it's a Ghost type. Apparently that doesn't come into play in this generation, but the generation after... Hangover, the gloom. Oh, same thing happened. It went down to bide from a fucking piplup. Ah, miss ya. Yeah, you you were pretty good actually. You were pretty good. And we do have a leaf stone. We could see what it would evolve to. Triple H, the Provo Pass. Ah, uh, it was a good one as well. Uh, sadly, went down to a Boneri with a high jump kick. I believe it was. Yeah, to a fucking Boneri. Ah, uh, Axel. Didn't really last long because we used them as, you know, um, you know, to get a little ba a bit of damage off Dragon Zord, if you remember. So he did a uh, noble sacrifice. Sorry I'm a super nerd when it comes to cartography, geography. I have copies of the original survey maps on Detroit and Saginaw. Okay. Next up, oh, it's our starter. It's our uh, Venusaur, Gangasaur, who, um, one of the uh, victims of Rayquaza. Fat Tony, the GOAT. Probably the saddest death so far in the Nuzlocke. I mean, Dragon's Order was on as well, that we'll get to later. Another victim of uh, Rayquaza in the Candlelight City Gym. Ring Sting, Lunatone, same situation. Uh, Rayquaza. Sean the Rapidash. Yeah, went down to Rayquaza as well. These four went down to Rayquaza. And finally. God rest ya, Dragon Zord. You did us so well, like, getting up to this part of the, uh, the Nuzlocke, and... Yeah, sadly went down to the Sandstream, of all things, and not the Ice Beam from Lapras. Honestly thought, like, it would survive the Sandstream, but, yeah, apparently not. It was kind of a bad move on my part, unfortunately. But, yeah, there's our little remembrance to who we've lost over, uh, the few streams of this. They did, um, they did their part. No, they did their part, like, you know, throughout the, uh, the Nuzlocke. So, yeah. Without further ado, folks. R.I.P., yes. Rest in peace to all of them. Without further ado, it's time. As, uh, good old Mark Henry would say, if I get the sound clip. Um, where is it here? Well, it looks like there's been enough talk. It's time for the main event. Damn right it is. I know it's weird, but there are free downloads from Library, the Library of Congress. All right. Let me confirm that you are qualified to challenge the Pokemon League. So let us examine the gym badges you gathered from Sinnoh. Orber City Cold Badge, Eternal City's Forest Badge, Hard Home City's Radic Badge, Fail Zone City's Cobble Badge, Pasoria City's Fen Badge, Canlave City's Mine Badge, Snow Point City's Icicle Badge, and Sunny Shore's Beacon Badge. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it's time. For the main event! Very well. Trainer, you've indeed collected all the gym badges of Sinnoh. Demonstrate the power that brought you here and go for glory. Not gonna lie, I'm nervous. I am fucking nervous. That music is so intense. Oh, hello. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon League. 
I am Aaron of the Elite Four. It's good to meet you. Oh, I should explain. I'm a huge fan of bug Pokemon. We're not going to have bug, bug Pokemon in this randomizer. Bug Pokemon are nasty, mean, and yet they're beautiful too. Would you like to know why I take on challengers here? It's because I want to become perfect, just like my bug Pokemon. Okay, let me take you on. Here we go. Jacqueline. Oh, this music. Whoa. Juggler Jacqueline. Jolteon. Level 49, okay. It's music. Thunderfang. Look at the health on Giratina, though. Fucking unit. Right, ancient power. Does that speed us? Won't fret, though. Toxic spikes, let's go. Yes. Right, try Dragon Claw. Still, though. Yeah, it's so speeding us, but Thunderfang ain't doing shit. But, oh, it's gonna use a. Yeah, full restore. We got 50 of them. Go Giratina, or shall I say Hades? At least Hades has done his part with the, uh, the toxic spikes. Now, unless um, a Pokemon he has has Levitate, that's the kind of uh, downside. Glammeo is next. Okay, I'm gonna deal with Glammeo. Totally take care of a Glammeo. Level 50. And it gets poisoned. Yes. Just got Intimidate. Yeah, it'll be funny to see, like, what random Pokemon has Levitate. <laughs> or, I think it's a hidden ability as well, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. Polyrat is next. We know who to bring in. We know who to bring in. Bring in the rice. <laughs> yes. Polyrath. I freaking love Polyrath. I do like Polyrath. Probably one of my favorite Gen 1 Pokemon. Oh, one hit wonder. Let's see if this will be a one hit wonder. Come on. Not quite. Bastard. Wow, she's gonna use the thing as well. Uh, I don't have Awakening, do I? He ate that. He did. Uh, we'll use the Lumberry. It's the same thing, really. Right, we're in the, uh... We're in the 50s anyway. Oh! Go down to the boys and go down, you fuck. Yes! Think the toxic spikes are working? Alright! <laughs> red versus red! Oh my god, are you serious? Rock smash. Get fucked. Oh, you... Double edge, okay. For a moment there, I thought he was going to have Hyper Fang. Oh, Jesus. Let's go. Jeez, I did a fair amount. Double edge. Vile Plume is next. Vile Plume, Jaden. Oh, this can't get poisoned. Because it's part poison. I think. Yeah, this is the last Pokemon he's got. Yeah, I think with the uh, Vile Plume there, he, he can't get poisoned. That's why he, he kind of got rid of it. Oh lord, that was a hit. 
Wait, what's that? Oh, he's got a berry. Here we go again with this shit. It's not over yet. Elite, uh, Elite Four cannot get up, give up. Eh. If I can speak. Petal dance. Eh. Shouldn't do too much. Fire foot to the face. Oh, not this again. Come on. Use our first full restore here. <clears throat> yeah, it's definitely gonna go down after this. Fuck, that did a fair bit. Foot to the face. A flaming foot to the face. There we go. I will now concede defeat. But I think you came to see how great bug type Pokemon are. I hope you are re also realize when oh, battling is deep. Yeah, yeah. I lost with the most beautiful and toughest of the bug Pokemon. Bitch, you didn't even have a bug, bug Pokemon. We lost because I wasn't good enough. That's it. Back to training camp. Let's hear it from me. No, that was wrong. Anyway, go on to the next room. Three trainers are waiting for you. They're all tougher than me. Right, before we do... Let's uh, top up our health. Alright, that's one down. Okay, that went pretty well. It did. Did in all fairness now. Yeah, we use most of the uh, super potions. Yeah, heal up. Indeed. I'm dreading Cynthia, what she's going to have. That's what I'm dreading. Alright, we'll keep... Yeah, we'll keep uh, Giratina in front. Right, up the lift. Hello. Well, well. You're quite the adorable trainer, but you've also got spine. Do we have enough? Oh, I think we do. Aha, I'm Bertha. I have a preference for ground-type Pokemon. Well, would you show this old lady how much you've learned? What, do we have enough healing? Oh, we do. Yeah, got plenty of it. Juggler Christine. Dragon Knight. Oh, this could be... This could be lethal. Right, Toxic Spikes first. Dragonite first, I mean... Yeah, it's gonna be... I don't know. Oh, the speed went up. It's gonna have speed regardless. Right, Dragon Claw. Oh, you missed... Come on. Oh. Missed again. oh, that was lucky. That was fucking lucky. Dragon Rush. Dodged the bullet there. We dodged the bullet. Maril is next. <coughs> Maril. Pika Blue. Well, Pika Blue, meet. Alright. Level 52. Oh, there's the Toxic Spikes. The luck, I know, right? Fuck. So far, that was probably the scariest Pokemon, um, yo, know, the Nuzlocke gave us here. The Randomizer. Right, down goes Pika Blue. That's why I nicknamed Meryl. Pika Blue. Magmar is next. Right. We can deal with Magmar. The Firecracker itself. Fucking hurt. <laughs> Level 55, oh god. Missed the fire blast. Going, going, going. You're fucked. Sun curtain is next. Oh my god. Really? 
Rash, get out there once again. Alright. <laughs> can't help it, folks. I can't help it. Oh, poisoned. And single beam. You should take it out. Starts off with a Dragon Knight to a fucking Song Kern. Oh, Fluffy. Yeah, we can deal with that. No biggie at all. Yes, yeah, Chris the Sheep. Well, it's a female. There we go. Poison once again. Shit, did we even need the uh, fucking Toxic Spikes? I mean, we're kicking ass here. And you are done. Juggler Christine, two down. Well, dear child, I must say that was most impressive. Your Pokemon believed in you and did their best to earn you the win. Even though I've lost, I find myself with this guilty grin. Or this grin or whatever. Went too quick there. You're quite something, youngster. I like how you and your Pokemon earned the win by working as one. That's what makes you strong. <laughs> I think that you can go as far as you want. Right, let's check up on our health here. Don't think we even got scratched, did we? Not even a scratch. Jesus. Right. Third member, oh, it's yourself. Yo, trainer. You had me counting the days on my fingers waiting for you to come. I heard from Valkner what you did in Sunny Shore. You managed to light, in, light a fire in that guy's heart again. How could you not expect me to look forward to seeing you in battle? You're facing a fire type Pokemon user with me. Let Flint see how, how hot your spirit burns. Jonathan. Look at this carrot top motherfucker. They're all jugglers. If you noticed. Umbreon. Alright, this could be... This could be dangerous. Um, Going really well. Alright, I'm gonna have to switch here. But to who? I'm gonna switch here. Who, to who though? Um, fuck it, Jaden. Just think an Aura Sphere or Single Beam would um, be super effective against it. Fucking Umbreon, though. Love Umbreon. It's my favorite evolution. But sadly, it's got to go down. Boosh. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, really? Oh, I'm not confused, Ray. Watch, he's gonna use the thing. Um, full restore. While he's doing that, I'm gonna use the full heal. Get out of that feckin' confusion. Watch, he's gonna use the full restore here. The moment the health hit red, there we go. Yeah, where's your fire type? I got a fire type, motherfucker. And wait for it, Bosch. Come on, critical hit. Uh, wait for it. Oh, come on. Confuse right once again, Jesus. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk having um you know getting hit by confusion here, so I'm gonna use another full heal. I've got what fifty of them. Faint attack. But right, I won't use another Aura Sphere. I think I can just knock it down with a with a slash. Yeah. I think we just knock it down with that. Whoa, what? Oh you motherfucker! Level 53 for Hades. Fucking aftermath. 
Steelix is next. Poseidon. That was dry, wasn't it? Fucking aftermath on Umbreon. That could have easily went south there if we weren't careful. Level 57. Earthquake this bitch. Yes. Oh god. Double edge. Send in the clowns. My crap hammer. This should definitely take it down. Not quite. Double edge again. Oh god, Poseidon, don't you dare. Jeez, this is getting tight now. Steelix was a scary one there now. Gloom is next. Right. You should be able to take it. Level 55. Yeah, we're just getting up in the levels here. I think Signal Beam should do the trick. Apparently not. Fuck. Fucking hell. Oh, we got the, we got the burn though. Lovely. Got the burn. Thunderbolt. Oh, it's not going down easily, is it? Uh-oh. Don't you dare. Oh, you son of a bitch. Yes! Ooh, that was a close one. I thought we were going to lose the rat. Wait, no. Hang on. Uh, yeah, we'll use use that. It's not what the Pokemon is. It's their levels. That's what... Oh, camera. Come on. Focus. Camera. Oh, yeah. Heal. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Come on. Camera. There we go. Oh my god, what the hell? Jesus, that took so much from us. Christ. To a gloom though, like, fuck's sake. Do they want to go into Jane because Jane's health was actually pretty low? Go on, hit yourself. Yes! No, we can't lose Rat. Damn right. What would take this down? Right, Rock Smash. Jesus. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Yes! Oh, it's gonna go down to the burn. Thank God for Flame Body, am I right? Right, what's next? Electabuzz. Shag it. I think that's what I'll do. I'll <clears throat> I'll go into Poseidon and heal him up. I mean, I like the buzz attacks. Can't really hurt him. All it takes one earthquake, I think. Oh, we're through. Oh, clever. That's gonna make any fucking difference. <laughs> Tackle, really? Like, why the fuck did he do that? <laughs> oh, what a dumb move. Right, I like the buzz is next. We got this. Alright, I think we are back, folks. Uh, 
Sorry about that. It seems that my router decided to just cut off like that just out of nowhere. Uh, took a bit longer than it did before when it did it in one of our previous streams of this randomized Nuzlocke. Uh, yeah, so we are back and yeah, apparently nothing much was missed. I did look over the uh, the twist stream on my phone through uh, mobile data. And the only thing that I really missed was like I took out the, the last Pokemon which was Electabuzz with Earthquake. And it was just the dialogue with, uh, with Caratop here. So yeah, uh, I think we are good to go. Uh, everything seems to be back to normal. Uh, I'd say probably no one's uh, still watching at the moment because of uh, how long that uh, disconnection was. Uh, but yeah, we will press on and we will uh, we will finish this. So let's see what uh, old Caratop has to say here. My damn controller. Oh, that's right. Hang on, hang on. We have to put background in, push back on here. There we go. There we go. Whew. Burnt right down to cinders. That's all you got to say. Fair enough. Right. Now, we will, uh... Heal up here. Heal Poseidon. Or heal, uh, Hades. Sorry, I'm a bit fuming after what uh, transpired there with that disconnection. Yeah, I mean, it happened before in one of our previous streams, but it didn't go as long as it did there now. I really went a little over two hours of that. I wasted like two hours of my life. And I want it back. I feel like Hans Molman. Oh, I'm just gonna waste him anyway. <laughs> well yeah, we're um on to the fourth member of the Elite Four and we will uh, get right to it. Yeah, so nothing much was overly missed anyway. I just used Earthquake on uh, Electabuzz and you know finish it off. Right, fourth member. So now, uh, we'll keep Hades in front for the toxic spikes. Ah, you timed your arrival well. I just finished reading a book, you see. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Lucian. Uh, Lucian? I am a user of the psychic type. I must say, you've already proven yourself to be outstanding by coming this far. They say I am the toughest of the Elite Four. I am afraid I'll have to go all out against you to live up to, live up to that reputation. Right, bring it on, Kate. Juggler Kate. Right, what should you bring it out first? Scizor, okay. Right, too bad. We'll throw the toxic spikes here. Night Slash, I figured you'd have that. This is gonna sting, actually. Jeez, that really stung. Right, we're gonna switch out. Bring out Jaden. Blaze Kick should take care of it, right? Steel Bug type. I'm thinking we should be alright. Yeah, we ate that. Right, Blaze Kick. Bob's your uncle. Going down, going down, and KO. Yeah, according to OBS, the um, the stream kind of went on a bit, uh, up to six hours. But yeah, I think um, you know, once it's live on YouTube or public on YouTube, it would just cut straight to the point where we reconnected. Relicant. Shit, can we actually use electric moves in this? Oh, we poison that anyway. Where's that? Oh, there we go. I thought like it was part ground, wasn't it? Or was it part rock? Regardless, it's going down. Level 56, by the way. Ooh, not so much yet. Mud Sport, okay. Oh, it's going to dampen the, the electric moves. Oh, yeah, it's going to... You fucking well. Full Restore. Yeah, apologies about that little disconnection. My Marusha just decided to cut off all of a sudden. No. Like, uh, I was chatting to Demoy there, who was in the chat there earlier. Said that, like, it's probably because, like, it does that to update or some shit. I think Ducky told me that as well. Uh, when it previously happened. In one of our previous streams. Double edge, oh boy. This is gonna hurt. That really hurt. Oh, God.
Go on the right. Or should I say? Alright. There we go. Jeez, I took the window of all right now. Right, wheezing is next. T1000. We got this. Oh, the spikes disappeared. Fuck. No, we should be alright, though. Crit this motherfucker. Come on. Oh, not so much. Sludge bomb. This could hurt now. Well, we poisoned us. That did hurt. Do another cycle cut. Alright, so far, the Leaf 4 hasn't been that bad. Probably the scariest Pokemon that came out was the, uh, the Dragonite. Hurt by poison. What was next? Hitmon Lee. Staying in, I'm gonna use a, um, a Thor Restore. Thank God it's not Hitmon Chan. We can deal with a Hitmon Lee. Yeah, I say there's not really many people still watching. Like, I mean, it is late for most people. Mega kick. Come on. Come on. Oh. Jeez, that did smart. Use some moo moo milk. Hmm. I'm not sure if yeah, Mega Kick does so much. Oh my god. You motherfucker. Well, there goes the T1000. There goes that. Right. Hades. Get in there. We'll use Dragon Claw. Right, 13 deaths in. Blaze kick. Oh, we ate that. Damn it, critical hit as well. Right, down goes Hitmonlee. Next, Dugong. Um, fuck, actually. Bloody, um, rat, or should I say? Rat! Isn't up to snuff with health. Level 59, oh fuck. That's a good ability for a Dugong, but it'll benefit us as well. Right, Moo Moo Milk. Didn't want to go into Jane because, yeah, Jane would definitely go down to this. Ice beam. Come on. Stay in this rat. Thunderbolt. Kill it. Please. Come on. What? Fuck. It's not good. Please live, please live, please live. Come on, rat. You fucking animal rat. Come on. You well, you survive. Good thing we got all these full restores. But sadly, T1000 went down. He's doing dive, is it? Yeah, dive. Oh, good Jesus. Oh, flame body. Yes. Lovely stuff. Gonna heal again. 
Might as well. We've got plenty of them. Right, this one's a doozy. I mean, look at the levels of the Pokemon. Level 59 now. Right, Ice Beam shouldn't do too much. Burn actually decreases the attack stat as well. So, this shouldn't do as much. Or do you know what we could do? Long shot here. Um, I'm going to go to Poseidon. And probably use Earthquake. Maybe that will take it down. Yeah, Ice Beam shouldn't do too much to um, Poseidon. Then again, oh Jesus Christ. Critical hit my ball sack. Right, we're in a bit of a kerfuffle here now. That was a crit as well. Fucking hell. Yeah, don't crit this time. Jesus. Right, there we go. You get burned. He's going to use thing. He's going to use a full restore, isn't he? Yeah, you bastard. Have an earthquake, bitch. That didn't do too much. Gonna top up the health just a wee bit. Just in case. Just in case now. Yeah, the, the flame body's gone now, so fuck. Safeguard, okay. Ain't gonna save you, really. Try Crap Hammer. Aqua Tail. Yeah, it really is the rain that's causing like the um the water moves to pinch up a bit. But there we go, we got him. Sadly well, we lost the T one thousand. Level fifty four for Hades. And we defeated Juggler Kate, I see. You getting past the three before me was no fluke. Damn right it wasn't. Congratulations, you've now beaten the Elite Four. However, that doesn't mean you're done with the Pokemon League. There remains the champion. I should warn you, the champion is far stronger than the Elite Four. Now go on, step through the doorway to your final battle. We will indeed. It's gonna be a doozy. Sadly, T1000 won't be joining us for the final battle. Yeah. I mean, it's a loss, I know, but... We might be able to do it. Everyone seems to be on, you know, good levels here. Even like Hades. So 13 deaths in. Now let me just check one thing that I have. Do I have any ethers? Oh, two ethers anyway. Hold on, let me look at the uh, the moves before we face the champ. What needs to be topped up here? Okay, maybe I'll I'll give the max eater to I'll give it to yeah you know, Poseidon for earthquake and for Hades probably ancient power. But we didn't have any PP ups for any of the uh, any of the Nuzlocke. I'm going to put you down here and I'm going to give you something else. Yeah, we're past the point now with the um, thing. I'm going to give you the leftovers. Yeah. Right, here we go. 
the champ. And we got Toxic Spikes, so we should be grand. Right, Cynthia. Oh, the piano. Have you been keeping well? Thank you for Mount Coronet and for the Distortion World. I'm truly grateful. Together, you and your Pokemon overcame all the challenges you face, however difficult. It means that you've triumphed over any personal weaknesses too. The power you learned, I can feel it emanating from you. But that's enough talk. Let's get on with why you are here. As the Pokemon League cha champion, I accept your challenge. Win. <laughs> this music. Alright, Gent Wayne. First up, <laughs> Pichu. This was, um, this is Spiritomb. Yeah, Spiritomb is usually her first Pokemon. So first up is Pichu. Set up the Toxic Spikes. You bitch with the Thunder Wave. Bitch. Tail Whip. Shouldn't be laughing, but... Sometimes you should gonna have something more powerful, you know, later on. Down goes Pichu. Alright, so far so good. Wooper is next. Wooper's next. Um right. Right. Pichu Wooper. Alright, so far so good. <laughs> I don't think you have the ground typing, do ya? Oh, you got the poison, though. Yeah, knew well. Should've known. Well, you're poisoned anyway. Right, single beam it. Muddy water. Oh, Jesus. Well, then again, that's the um, thing coming into play. Oh, she's going to use thing, isn't she? Yeah. Alrighty then. Fuck. Right, I'm going to switch out. I'm going to switch out. Yeah, right, you. You're not really doing it for us. I guess... Poseidon. Well, oh, missed. Keep forgetting that, like, Wooper has the ground type as well, along with uh, Quagsire. Right, Crab Hammer. Let's see if this will do it. With the rain and all. Should. Boom. All right. The rain stopped. Rampardos is next. Rampardos, that's a rock type. So yeah, we should take it down with Jaden. This is music though. Yeah, Aura Sphere should take it down. Slowly but surely. One shot. Get in. Right, three down. Jeez, that's some experience. Registeel. Oh, this is our legendary. Fuck. Staying in. Well, I could have went to, um... Thing. Swampert. Oh, hang on now. The drought. Perfect. It'll boost up the... The blaze kick. Oh, not so much, okay. Oh, it's got the berry. Lock on. All right. Sunlight is strong. Good to know. Blaze kick again. Come on. We can do this, we can do this. Oh. Charge beam. Oh boy. Come on, survive this, Jaden. Come on, Jaden. Yes! 
she gonna use Ting again? Yeah, full restore. That's good because we could just Aura Sphere it. Down you go. Not so much. Right. We'll definitely outspeed it now for the next turn. I think she's got four full restores or three. She definitely has another one, I think. But so far, so good. That's four down. Lots of experience. Oh my god. Sunlight is strong. Right, what's next? It is... Agron. Could stay in. Well, then again, we could go into, um, thing. Level 60. Protect all you want. Yeah, this is Rock Steel, I believe, so... Yeah, we should take it down with a Aura Sphere. Let's go, Jaden! Clean it up here. Clean in house. So far, the Ragged Seal has been, like, the problem. But we took it down in the end. Level 56 for Jaden. Get in, love. Get in. Right. Last Pokemon, I think. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> oh, my God. Are you serious? I can't remember the last time I was put in a corner like this. Well, with the Pokemon you have, love. We're going down. Oh, no. We're not going down to a Caterpie. We are certainly not going down to a Caterpie. <laughs> My God. Oh, what? Solar power there? Well, there's your solar power. A fiery kick to the face. And, ladies and gentlemen, the Nuzlocke is over. Just a few minutes ago, you were the most powerful challenger. And just now, you became the most powerful of all the trainers. You are now our newest champion. Yes. That was excellent. Truly an outstanding battle. You gave the support your Pokemon needed to maximize their power. And you guided them with certainty to secure victory. You have both passion and calculating coolness. Together, you and your Pokemon can overcome any challenge that may come your way. Those are the impressions I got from our battle. I'm glad I got to take part in the crowning of Sinnoh's new champion. Come with me, we'll take the lift. We did it, folks. The fourth Nuzlocke of the channel, done and dusted. Oh, Lord. There we go. The room ahead is the Hall of Fame. Oh, Professor Rowan. Cat, your last battle was splendid. Oh, hello, Professor Rowan. Hmm? A child I enlisted for my Pokedex projects has come this far. It's only natural that I come and witness the child's crown and glory. Cat, I shouldn't call you a child anymore. You've grown into a real champion. Professor, you still enjoy the enthusiasm kids bring to your research, don't you? Cat, step this way, please. Professor Owen, please join us. It's been a long while since I last entered this room. If your last time here was when I became champion, then yes. That would be quite a long time ago. Cat, welcome to the Hall of Fame. Your names will be recorded for posterity here. What you are leaving are the memories of your adventure so far. It's time to record your names, you and your Pokemon. Remember your Pokemon are partners that grew with you through many challenging battles. This machine will make a permanent record of your achievement. And there we go. And T1000 was in it all and sadly he went down in um, the Leaf 4. Hades. Met a distortion world. Jaden met out route 210. All right. All right. Hasha Celestia in town. 
Poseidon, a Valor Lakefront. Schmokey, Route 213, and I was originally a Wingle. That was our HM slave. T1000, who sadly went down, met at Mining Museum. Oh yeah, it was a fossil. But there we go. Look at that for a team. <laughs> Look at the, wi the wing of uh, Giratina blocking uh, Raichu's face. <laughs> oh, poor old... Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, look at that for a team, though. Yeah, Petty Dragon Sword didn't come along for the ride. And also, um, you know, like our starter in that. Uh, we had a very solid um, Pokemon throughout the uh, randomizer, I have to say. And yeah, 52 minutes, 57 seconds. So that kind of counts towards the, uh, the grinding I did uh, off stream as well. But there you have it, folks. There you have it. League champion. Our fourth randomizer, Nuzlocke, done and dusted. Jeez, that was too easy of a champion battle. <laughs> awesome. Right, saving. Don't turn off the power. And yeah, folks, I do apologize for that brief disconnection from my router. It just cut off all of a sudden. But yeah, decide, you know, I didn't want to leave it till another time. I want to get this done, like, today. So, yeah, it took longer than expected for it to uh, come back online, but it did, and yeah, we breezed through it. And there you have it. Cue the credits. So, ladies and gentlemen, this wraps up this uh, live stream of Pokemon Platinum, the Randomizer Nuzlocke, folks, our fourth one on the channel. And overall, this has been um, quite a roller coaster of a Randomizer Nuzlocke. Now, honestly, thought that like we were going to get a game over at a certain point, you know, the... Rayquaza debacle, I will call it, in a Candle of City. I thought we were going to get the game over there. That was really the bit where I thought, like, oh, we we're going to fail this Nuzlocke. And, yeah, really it was a rocky start at the beginning because with all the Pokemon we did catch, like, some of the trainers had, like, legendaries and, like, took down some of our earlier Pokemon. You know, such as, like, the Omanyte and also the Jolteon as well. You know, pity we never had the chance to use them properly throughout the Nuzlocke. And, yeah, so we have, um... So our Pokemon was actually pretty decent in uh, Venusaur, who, um, yo, again, requires a debacle. Took down four of our members. That's where I nearly wanted to give up. And I was like, yeah, this is going to be game over here. Uh, yeah, oh, it's going to be a uh, flashback in here to all our, um, all our memories, folks. All our memories of, um, <laughs> of this Nuzlocke. But yeah, so that is it. That is it. So the next time we do a randomizer Nuzlocke, folks, will be with Gen 5. And that'll be with uh, Pokemon Black. And probably along with that Pokemon Black 2 as well. I'll probably do the two games to count towards uh, Gen 5. Uh, so that's kind of my goal, is to do like most of the generations. Like probably Gen 6 and Gen 7 with, you know, Pokemon Y and Pokemon Sun or Moon as well. So probably up to them uh, generations. And that will mean that we won't stop there. We may do uh, some... Uh, other games, like even like, you know, Gen 6 again with uh, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Because they're good games in itself to do a randomizer of. And maybe some fan games along the way. You never know if um, if there's interest, of course. Which I say there will be. I say, you know, people do love these randomizer Nuzlocke. And I love them myself, you know. Be it watching people play them, I mean, or um, myself playing them. Like I was going to say, yeah, the... Uh, like, the people that, you know, got me into randomizer Nuzlocke, you know, be it, like, Irish Emerald, Jade Animations, and what have you. Always enjoy, like, really enjoy watching um, people do, like, randomizer Nuzlocke. It's really, really fun. Or any Nuzlocke in general. I mean, like, there is so much of a variety you could do in Nuzlocke. But I do like doing that as a randomizer, like how I've set up. Yeah, and um, if you want a real challenging uh, time with a Pokemon game... Yo, I would, um, you know, recommend doing a randomizer Nuzlocke. You know, it really changed your uh, view on, like, certain Pokemon you never used before. But, yeah, uh, we did get lucky with some of the encounters. Like, Blaziken, for example, was a lucky one. Swampert was a real lucky one, in my opinion. That was probably the, one of the most lucky ones. And Dragonzord as well. Sadly, like, you know, Dragonzord didn't, like, yeah, come along for, uh, you know, the Pokemon League. Really thought he was going to join us for the Pokemon League, but... It is what it is, folks. It is what it is. Uh, 13 deaths in. So that's a bit more than our... Um, I think that's more than our Emerald Nuzlocke. And def definitely um, less than our Soul Silver Nuzlocke. Because I remember Emerald, we had a fair few deaths in that as well. I have to go back and look anyway. Because when I did Emerald, we did the, uh, the post-game. Like, you know, it was optional. We did the post-game optional. So that didn't really count towards, like, um, you know, losing, losing the Nuzlocke and that. Because we bet the Pokemon League. Because I wanted to just check out the post-game just for shits and giggles. And, you know, there is post-game of this as well. Uh, I think there's like, yo, you go back to see what, um, you know, Dialga and Palkia randomized set. And also, there's, um, going to that, that 
uh, cave where Heatran is as well. But I'm not really going to bother with that because it is kind of getting late for me here. And yeah, so next uh, stream on Friday, uh, I'm not sure, probably Fall Guys again. I'm not sure because I don't really have anything much lined up for Friday. So I'm just going to go with uh, Fall Guys. And then I will be back streaming, po uh, not Pokemon, <laughs> uh, Pokemon in the mind here. Uh, WWE 2K24, the My Rise at Career Mode. Uh, we'll see how much we've left in that in uh, Saturday. And yeah, so the next game we'll be streaming on Wednesday. I'm going to actually put it up to a vote. I will uh, start uh, putting up a poll and um, probably pick some random games here and there just to, um, you know, have you decide. And yeah, so I think that is it, folks. That is um that is the credits. Oh, we're back in Twin Leaf, back home. Home sweet home. Finn. Indeed. And there we go. And back to uh, the main menu. Now. Right, there we go. So yeah, anyways, folks, I am going to actually end off the stream here. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see y'all in the next one.